Oh my goodness. Hi everyone. <laughs> I've not been here for a few days because I was at VidCon, but I'm finally back. I have finally returned and um, we have lots to discuss. There, Tilly, you can't say that. <laughs> Oh my god! Tilly, you can't say that in my Twitch chat! <laughs> oh no! Okay. So, um... I have a lot, we have a lot to talk about. Shella, you can't say that in my Twitch chat! <laughs> ah! Okay, so... Um... Yeah, we'll get into it. We'll get into it. Because VidCon was such an experience for me. Um, never, never seen anything like it, actually. Um, and then I went to Disneyland and I saw celebrities. It was great fun. So we'll talk. We'll talk. <laughs> I want to give people a second to come into the stream because... Oh, and I can get the video pulled up too. I'm going to show you all the video of... Um... No, no, no. Pause, pause, pause. I want you to see the video of the incident. I, I feel like it's only fair that I, I properly show you everything, you know? Um, Shella, you can't say that. I mean, I think I'll probably say it, but you saw me at VidCon? Oh, well, hi! Welcome to the stream. I hope you had fun. VidCon was fun. Have I seen the same summit? Yeah, I, uh, I watched the, the live stream um, and I made a video on it earlier. So, what are we talking about? There was an ad and you missed it? I haven't started talking about it yet, Abby. In fact, I haven't said it out loud yet. Um, we'll, we'll get into it. I want to give people a few minutes to come here so that I don't have to tell a story multiple times because there's, there's only so many times a person can talk about... Can I say it? There's only so many times a person can talk about the fishball incident, okay? And I know that you don't know what I'm talking about and that's okay because I'll explain. I've been waiting for my time to explain this to you for days. <laughs> as soon as it happened, I was like, I can't wait to explain this to people. <laughs> so we'll talk. We'll talk. Anyway, <laughs> hey, Kaylee, um, Alia, and Prina, and Susie, and Moxie, and Mrs., and Libby, uh, and Aria, and Lisa, and Mr., and, and uh, TF, and Margo, and Raquel, and Alyssa, and Miss Bookworm, and Kit Kat, and Danny. Call me Emma, Gems, uh, Claire, Cridley, Erin, Mistress, Ashley, um, Thad, and Beelines, and Mile, and Val, and Lucian, and Mage. Um, oh my god, I missed a lot. Sean, Minecraft, AJ, Mara, Romantic, Tinker, Hot Apple Pie, Mad Fly, Rebecca, Angel, Lexa, XD, and Maze, and Teresa, and Bentley. Oh my god, I haven't streamed in like five days, so everybody had resubs. I'm so sorry. Thank you all so much. Uh, Kimmy. Bentley, Standard, Ruby, Pearly, Clumsy, Little Blue, Hex, and Onyx, and Hello, and Qu uh, Kira, and Celine, Tilly, uh, Missy, Stardew, Lucy, Shella, Bubbles, Christine, and Isabella. That's everybody. I did it. Oh my god. <laughs> also, Margaret, and Sarah, and Kay Norton, and Mandy, and Dr. Robbie, and Dahlia, and Mechanical, and Amnesia, and Phil, and Sims, and Cookie, and You're on Your Own Jack, and Spooky, and Little Hazy, and Oh No, Beans, Clancy, how much did I miss? I tried to catch up, and then I got uncaught up again. Anyway, so... Basically, I went to VidCon, okay? I flew to California, I went to VidCon, it was great fun. Um, after VidCon, me and Dan went to Disneyland, which was also pretty fun, and I got back yesterday. <laughs> um, you know what? Let's talk about this for a second. So, I flew to VidCon on Thursday, right? That was fun. Except, except, the Sims team decided to drop a trailer for the horse pack on Thursday. <sighs> Not fun. So I left my house at 4 a.m., okay? Flew all the way to California. Got there. Got straight to my hotel. Thankfully, it was ready in the morning, which was lucky. Filmed the horse pack reaction video. Edited the horse pack reaction video. Posted the horse pack reaction video. And then went and did my meet and greet at VidCon. <laughs> and then I came home. My meet and greet ended. Um, and I got back to the hotel. And I literally fell asleep at 8 p.m. <laughs> like, it was such a long day. <laughs> Probably one of the longest days I've ever had. Um, it was rough. <laughs> but we did it. We did it. It was fine. It was fine. It was fun. We managed. Um, running on pure adrenaline from that meet and greet for sure. And I went back and I went to bed as the second I got home. 
<laughs> which was good though. I was, I needed the sleep. Um, and then the next morning I had a panel. Okay, and this panel is where the drama comes in. This panel is where um, things get exciting. So we'll come back to the meet and greet. I just gotta tell you about this first because I, you just have to know. So on my panel, um, I was quite nervous about it because going into it at first, originally, it was a bunch of streamer men that I had never met before and did not know. And I was like, this is gonna be kind of scary. Like I'm a little bit intimidated. Um, and then the person who was originally gonna host the panel dropped out and wasn't coming to VidCon anymore. So they asked 8-Bit Dylan to like host the panel instead, which I was so relieved by. You have no idea. Cause I've known Dylan for like, uh, since like 2016. He was like one of the first people I ever met in person at a, like a event. So I've, I've known Dylan for years. So when they had Dylan do it instead, I was like, oh my God, my savior. <laughs> this is the best day of my life. Thankfully, someone I know is going to be on it because I was quite nervous. Um, Dream was going to be on the panel. Like there was kind of some big names. And so I was, um, I was quite anxious about it, you know, going into it, um, which I think is understandable. <laughs> anyway, we do the panel. Um, I thought it did pretty well. It was great fun. Um, we did it. And then... Towards the very end of the panel, we had like a clock in front of us so I could see how much time we had left and there was like eight minutes left or something. So it was close to the end of the panel. It was an hour long. All of a sudden, this person starts walking up to the stage, okay? And I was kind of like waiting for someone to like, you know, stop them. Well, they get up to the stage and there's, there's like, kind of like at concerts, you know, there's like a fence and then a gap, and then the stage. So they're up at the fence, and they start yelling at us, right? They're in a shark costume. And they start yelling at us. And then all of a sudden, they climb the fence. Oh, they're over the fence. Oh my God, now they're on the stage. They climbed onto the stage, okay? And this part is a little bit gross, so I just wanna warn you, content warnings for like sexual content. He said, have you ever seen a fish's balls before? Grabbed himself, and I thought he was gonna like get them out. I thought he was gonna like, but he didn't, thankfully. And then started doing the worm on the stage. And then, and then security comes up, picks him up, and carries him off the stage behind us as he is flopping like a fish behind us, okay? Like, like he continued to flop around like flailing as security picked him up and carried him off the stage. I'll show you a video. I'll show you a video. Anyway, so while this is happening, none of us had any clue what to do. Like <laughs> one of the people was talking still, like as this shark was coming up to the stage. And then Dylan was like, security, <laughs> security. <laughs> And then, like, after the shark was gone, nobody said anything. Like, it's just, like, we kept going. It was like, okay, well, next question is... <laughs> it was so weird. And when he came behind us, you'll see in the video, because he was, like, flopping so much, I thought he was going to, like, hit me or something, so I was, like... Um, <laughs> it was so weird. Well, no, you don't really want to acknowledge it much, Alex. This is the thing. Like, uh, Dylan was like, security, and then after he got picked up and taken away, Dream was like, give it up for security! And then everybody just kind of went past it, because you don't want to talk about it too much, like, you don't want to, you know, because they're doing it for attention, um, so, like, you don't really want to sit there and, and give them the attention that they desire, because they already climbed on the stage, but for me, at the time, when I was, like, when it was happening, and as he was climbing the fence, I kept waiting, 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 waiting for like someone to stop him and they didn't. <laughs> um, and then he got on the stage and once he was on the stage, this is the thing, right? You don't know what they're gonna do. Like obviously he just did something kind of gross and then danced and like was trying to get attention. But what if he was gonna hurt somebody? Like you don't know when he's climbing over what his intentions are. Like I was so, I was scared. I was like, what's he gonna, what's he gonna do? You know, so it kind of, it freaked me out at the time. I was really, really anxious about it. I think that like looking back on it, it's kind of funny. But at the time, my heart was like pounding out of my chest because I could see him 
Like, I, I also had seen him in the audience before he walked up, because he was wearing a shark costume. So I was like, oh, there's a shark. And then all of a sudden the shark was on stage. Anyway, let me show you the video. <laughs> so you can see what I'm talking about. This is from the video that Dan filmed um, of the, the panel. So Dan didn't even know that like this was gonna happen, obviously. Dan was just filming the panel. Um, and so uh, he could, he saw the whole thing. He got the whole thing on camera. And also it was live streamed. I didn't know that it was gonna be live streamed, but it was. And my parents were watching, but the live stream on YouTube could only see like this, the screen. They were showing them the cameras. Um, and obviously during this incident, VidCon didn't show like what happened. So my parents just heard Dylan being like security, security, and like heard the scuffle. Um, and then saw like the flailing go because they had the camera only on Dylan's face, not on everybody else, because they were trying not to show the full the full stage when it was happening. So they like heard Dylan be like security, security, and then heard the scuffle, and then heard like just saw the shark go directly behind Dylan's head. <laughs> anyway, uh, let me show you the video so that you can see what happened, um, and we can watch it back. Shark, yeah. Look, so here's the shark going up. So you can see he's walking up to the front of the front of the stage. I'm right there. Aaron is still talking. No one else is going on. And then all of a sudden the shark, he at this point the shark was yelling at us. I didn't really understand what he was saying. It's hard to hear in there because um like the stage is quite big and there's like lots of talk. This is just open in the convention center as well. So like there was kind of a quiet corner with the audience, but then the audience is big and then it's open to like the rest of everything else. So at this point the shark is tiny but it's right there and it's about to climb the fence. So you can see it climb the fence. Dylan says, please step back. Okay, please step back. And now it's on the stage. Shark on the stage. And that's when he says, suck on these and starts like, is there a way to zoom in? I'll show you some close up videos. This is just the far away so you can get the whole thing. I can't zoom in from this video, no. Just get the whole vibes, get the whole vibes. He's on the stage. Now security's coming. Watch this. I'll show you closer up later. Picks up the shark. And that is how you don't make Dylan says, and that is how you don't make content. Give a hand to security. And they had to carry him off behind us. <laughs> while he was still flailing the whole time. And then Dylan's like, so on to the next question, as if nothing happened. It was so weird. <laughs> Here, this is, um, someone else had this video from closer up so that you can see this. See, he was flailing. So my my thing is, right, you can see better the, like how there's a fence right here and then the stage. So he climbed the fence and then got on the stage. I, I assumed, okay, I assumed that there would be security by the fence? There wasn't. <laughs> there wasn't. Um, I don't know. I don't know. Um, <laughs> it's really weird too, because at VidCon, the hotel security is wild. Like, they had a perimeter around the hotel. They wouldn't let anybody in without a badge. Like, they, they were so, so serious about the hotel security. We had to scan in backstage to get in and out of the convention center. So, like, where is the security presence around the stage? <laughs> yeah, I know, and that's the other thing. I didn't know if this was public knowledge, but I've seen people, people in chat talk about it. That's not VidCon security. That's Dream security. Um, I don't know how people know that, but I like I saw it when I was back there. That's not VidCon. That's Dream Security. So it's a good thing he's known on Twitter. Okay, so people know that guy. Well, that's well. There you go. That's so I didn't want to say it without like it being confirmed. But that's Dream Security, not VidCon Security. It's Dream Security. So I don't know. <laughs> and I think that the reason he walks them back, like, cause I was wondering why did he walk him like across the stage behind everybody instead of taking him back over here. But I wonder if they had more security on the other side. So he was walking them to them over here. But anyway, weird. <laughs> nice to have personal security, I guess. Well, it's a good thing he does. No, VidCon never said anything to me about this, about the panel, ha this happening on the panel, Christine. 
I was talking to, um, at Disneyland, I ran into CPK, and he was like, oh, how was your VidCon, you know? And I was like, oh, I did a panel. There was a shark on the stage, and he was like, you were on that one? <laughs> Um, so people knew about it. it. Word spread when a thing like this happens. But yeah, anyway. Um, just now spotted me in the vid. Oh yeah, I'm this person. It's not a very high quality video. That's me. <laughs> um, but yeah. It was just, it's just kind of scary. I think that like, obviously nothing bad happened, right? Um, so like, it's fine. Nothing bad happened. We're all okay. Um, but I think it's scary thinking about what could have happened, you know? Um, Cause what if, what if he had like tried to hurt somebody, you know? And you don't know in the moment, plus like watching the videos back, it all happened really fast. But in the moment, I fully thought by the way that he was gonna like expose himself to the stage because that's what he said. So I was like, what is he gonna like take his clothes off? Like that's, that's what I thought was gonna happen. Cause he said that. <laughs> so like, you don't know, you don't know what's gonna happen. Um, and it's scary. It's scary that he was able to get up there. But anyway, um, anyway. So that was my panel. <laughs> yeah, they had metal detectors going in. They were checking bags and stuff. So presumably he wouldn't have had anything, but that doesn't mean that he's not gonna hurt anyone, you know? Um, but anyway. It's just weird. <laughs> um, how was it outside of that? It was fun. Outside of that, VidCon was really fun. Um, and my, my meet and greet went really, really well. Um, I, I always get so nervous about things like that, especially about meet and greets and stuff, because it's like, you don't know um, <laughs> who's gonna show up, what's gonna happen. <laughs> you don't really know like what the vibes are gonna be. Um, and I also always get really anxious about the meet and greets because they really kind of rush you along. Like, they're trying to um, make sure you get through everybody. Um, but it makes me feel really weird when I'm like trying to talk to someone and the security is like, all right, now pose for the picture. And it's like, okay, well, can they finish their sentence? So I, that part was kind of like, I know, I know they have to, to like make sure everybody gets a chance, but um, I don't know. <laughs> that part's kind of hard, but it was really nice. I got to meet a bunch of you, so. Um, Guess this is on nobody's bingo card. No, I don't think anybody expected the shark to happen. Me and Dylan were talking um, before the panel because we were both kind of nervous and we were like, you know what, no matter what, even if the panel goes disaster disastrously, we're gonna have a story. Like it'll be either good or funny and we'll have a story. We got a story. <laughs> we definitely got a story out of that one, yeah. <laughs> Uh, we, we certainly did, but it was funny because we were talking about that for ages. Um, so that, that made me laugh when it, you know, afterward, after we calmed down. <laughs> um, yeah, I met Allison, um, Allison Kutch and Isaac. That was kind of funny because in the, uh, VidCon hotel came up to me and they were like, Hey, or well, he was like, Hey, my wife loves your videos. And I was like, really? I see you on TikTok all the time. <laughs> so we got to meet. That was kind of cool. Um, and then me and Dan went to Disneyland. Um, and at Disneyland, okay, so we went on Saturday to Disneyland, right? And we get there, and there's this place that sells beignets at Disneyland that everybody talks about. So Dan was like, we gotta get these. Like, everybody talks about it so much, right? So we're sitting there. It's like right next to where Pirates of the Caribbean is at Disneyland. We're sitting there, um, and there's like nobody around. It was like 8.45 in the morning, okay? The park had just opened. Nobody was around. Um, and the girls at the table next to us we're like, oh my God, I love you, like waving up high. So I thought, oh, maybe like there's a character, like maybe Mickey Mouse came out or something. Um, but I had noticed before when we were sitting down that there was like lights up there, like like lights for photo taking. Um, and so we're like, oh, that's kind of cool. I wonder if like maybe somebody's gonna like get engaged and do a photo shoot. You know, I was kind of like imagining that was happening. And then one of the girls goes, it's Owen Wilson. And I was like, what? So me and Dan stand up to go look. At this point, there's like just like the five of us are standing there. Nobody's around yet because nobody else saw. Owen Wilson plays Lightning McQueen. Owen Wilson. ka -chow. Yeah. Anyway, Owen Wilson is up there. I got to get you these pictures so that you can see. This was so weird. I'm going to search in me and Hope's DM so that I can find it. Um. <laughs> okay, so let me show you the picture. This is later so you can get a better image of like a mental image of what it looks like. Um, so look at this, right? We're sitting here 
And this place, um, we're like on underneath this. There's like there's like a balcony downstairs too, and we're sitting like right below them. Okay. Where's Owen? This is what I first saw when I walked out there. Owen Wilson was right there. Kachow. And then Jamie Lee comes out. And she starts talking about, like, she's like, oh yeah. Lindsay Lohan's having a baby, talking to everybody. At this point, a crowd had kind of formed. And then they were like, okay, we have to film now. And they turned around and started filming. And they were playing like a game. They had like um, sticks with like pictures on them. And they were playing some sort of game. They're, they, these three people are all in the new Haunted Mansion movie. So I think that they're, they're filming promo for Haunted Mansion, um, the new film that's coming out. So we'll see when, when this interview comes out. Um, we'll be like, I was there. <laughs> Um, but this was so cool. It was so cool. Um, cause they were right there. And, and that was like right after we got to Disneyland. It was like the first hour we were at Disneyland. It was so cool. Um, but anyway, <laughs> I had a rather eventful couple of days, basically. Um, as you can imagine, <laughs> there was a lot happening. <laughs> um, but yeah, yeah. Like, what the heck? What the heck? Anyway, I can show you guys if you really want to. I can show you that shark video again in case you just came in and then we'll play, start playing Stardew. Um, just in case you missed this, we can watch it again. So this shark came on stage during my panel and um, threatened to expose himself and then started doing the worm. Um, so... I did tell you about Owen Wilson, Brew. Look back in mods. I did. I would not shut up about it. Literally all weekend, I was like, guess what? I met, well, I didn't meet Owen Wilson. <laughs> he didn't even see me, I don't think. But I was there. And he was like right above my head. So did I meet Owen Wilson? No. But... What did Dan think about as the shark, about the shark as it was happening? Do you know, Ozzy, I asked him about that. I was like, were you scared? And he was like, no, not really. And I was like, I was. <laughs> I was scared. What do you mean you weren't scared? But Dan said he wasn't scared. He was like, oh, that's weird. I was scared. Because what was he going to do? When he jumped the fence, what was he going to do? I think that as it was happening... It felt like it was taking longer for me because I could see him coming up. I don't think Dan saw him walking up. Only saw him when I got on the stage because he was kind of far back. And also because I was close to him and it was happening to me, it felt like it was taking ages. But I think in reality, it wasn't, it wasn't that fast or that was, wasn't that long of a time that he was up there. It was kind of fast. It just felt very long to me as I was experiencing it, you know? <laughs> um... But anyway, Alicia, uh, I think that the panel is on VidCon. Let me see. Because they did live stream it. You'd have to go back and find it on their thingy. Um, live streams. Did they take them away? Oh, they might have taken them down. I don't see it on their thingy anymore. Hmm. I don't see it, but maybe I'm like looking in the wrong place. Um, yeah, there's quite a few videos of this, but, uh, um, but anyway, anyway. <laughs> what was the panel about? It was about, um, the, it was called I Dream of Streaming. And it was about like just generally live streaming. Basically, people were talking about our streams and everything. Um, but anyway, <laughs> did I meet Dream? Oh, only barely. I didn't talk to him really before or after. Um, he kind of like came and went as soon as it was, you know, like he wasn't like hanging around before or after. So I didn't talk to him just on the stage. But anyway, to be honest, I don't really blame him because he probably had, this is the thing, right? Like that happened to me when I was on that panel. But like, I would assume that kind of thing happens to him like the whole time he's there at the convention. I bet it's kind of stressful to be like a giant YouTuber at a convention. Like, I bet that's kind of, um, 
I don't know. <laughs> There's a reason he has private security at the event who carried a shark off the stage. Let's just say that, right? <laughs> There's a reason these people bring private security to these things. So anyway, um, we're going to play some Stardew Valley today, I think was my plan. Uh, cause I got back home so late last night, I am frankly exhausted, so I kinda just want to farm, if that's okay. Let me get the game open. Um, where's VidCon? Oh, it's in Anaheim, it's in California. Um, but, anyway. Anyway, I'm trying to get it open. You're so cool, who, me? I think that I did pretty well on the panel. <laughs> Not to like... But I, I was impressed with the, um, when I was speaking, I don't think that I sounded as absolutely terrified as I felt, which is what I mean. I feel like I, I was noticing as I was speaking, when my voice wasn't shaking, but I would finish a sentence and then be like, <gasps> heart pounding. <laughs> it would take me a second to calm down after I finished talking. But I don't think that my voice sounded shaky. I think that like, um, in that sense, it went pretty well. So, anyway. What my dad called Dream? Oh, my dad thought Dream was called Flesh. He asked me one time a, a question about Flesh, and I was like, what are you talking about? That he thought Dream was called Flesh. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know where that came from. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> It's kind of cute, kind of creepy, if I'm not gonna lie, but we'll let him to that. I guess it's like a one word thing. Maybe he's thinking like Minecraft. There's like zombie flesh in Minecraft. That's what I'm assuming. He's like, I know it's a one word thing and the guy plays Minecraft. I, I, but I don't really think that, and, and probably maybe he thought, I asked him once if he was comparing him to Corpse, but my dad didn't know who Corpse was. So, I don't know. You would think that, but I don't think he knows about Corpse. But, <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> it was quite the um, interesting weekend though, I think. So, <laughs> oh, and I have one more story. Smajor, Scott, t completely jump scared me after my meet and greet, which is fine, it was funny. But I've never, I was so scared. I was sitting on the bench waiting for the shuttle to bring us back to the hotel. And Scott ran up to me and just appeared in my face. And I looked up from my phone and I was like, oh my God. <laughs> oh my God, it's Scott. Anyway, surprise Scott. <laughs> um, but I'm glad I got to see him. Scott has been a friend of mine for a long time. He was probably like, this is embarrassing, but he was one of the only friends I had that was at VidCon, <laughs> so I was pretty glad that he was there. Um, that was a relief, but anyway. It's a good thing he wasn't a shark. Yeah, seriously, right? It's a good thing he wasn't dressed in a shark costume. Would have been too far. Would have been too far. Um, let me put all my stuff away. Is that... Those winter seeds don't belong in there. What do you think you're doing? Okay, last time we played, we got four prismatic shards in one day. I got the, um, I have my fancy sword now and I have three more prismatic shards. So we're doing quite well, I would say. Um, you wanna jump into the VidCon Squishmallow pet? Do you know what? I didn't get to walk the floor at VidCon a single time. I didn't go out there at all. I only, um, I like stayed backstage and stayed at the hotel. One thing I will say is the hotel at VidCon was so different than I imagined. I I pictured it would just be a hotel and people would take the shuttle to and from the convention, but the hotel was like a convention in itself. Like uh, YouTube and TikTok and Instagram all had these like ridiculous lounges in the hotel with like lights and live music and a bar and like all of this seating. Like they like, I don't even want to know how much money got spent on the lounges at the hotel, but there was like all of these things at the hotel um, for, for, like, the creators at the hotel, which was very different than I expected, I guess. Um, it was cool, but it was, like, kind of wild. Um, but it was nice in there. Um, I don't know. It's just, like, so much goes on at these things that, like, 
I don't know. It was kind of fun for me as a person who's been like a fan of YouTube for so long to to go to VidCon and like see it in this way. Cause like, remember the golden era of YouTube when like all those people were at VidCon every year and like, it just, I don't know. That was fun for me. <laughs> it was fun for me to see it um, and like be there with all of that going on, you know? Um, but anyway, <laughs> it was cool. Um, and now you are all those people. Not really, not really, Samantha. <laughs> the creators we're talking about are a little bit, little bit bigger than I am. <laughs> I'm, I'm talking about like the Zoella era, you know? Good times. Good times. Okay, find the shadowy figure, catch a squid. We gotta bring some eggs, stuff like that. Anyway, <laughs> I still can't believe that shark thing happened to me. Like, how is that even possible? Anyway, <laughs> anyway. Tilly, I don't think of myself in that way though. I don't know, I guess I can see that. Like to me, you're Kayla. Well, imagine how I feel. <laughs> yeah, you, you think I think of myself as a person who has a following? No. Kayla, I'm just Kayla. Anyway, does a heater help in any way? Well, do you know what? I always get a heater, but someone told me that I don't need it with the expanded mod. Is that true? Because they could have lied to me and I wouldn't know, but someone told me I don't need it with the expanded mod. Thoughts on that? You need it with the expanded mod. So they lied to me? Wow. Wow. Unbelievable. <laughs> Let me get these. No milk right now? Okay. Did you miss the VidCon recap? I did talk about it, but I'll talk about it again soon. Don't worry. We'll rediscuss. Where's TwitchCon gonna be? Oh, it's gonna be in Vegas this year. Well, the one that I'm going to, cause they have, um, there's a TwitchCon happening this month in Paris, but I'm not gonna be there. Too much going on. And frankly, I'm very glad that I decided not to go because now the horse pack is coming out. <laughs> so that's a relief. Um, that is a relief. Okay, let me put that away too and I'll sell this stuff. Very nice. Um, nothing what happens on the East Coast? I know. They put all these things so far away from us, huh? It's messed up. I'm curious how the Vegas one is gonna go. It'll be, it will be interesting, I think. Um, 18 out of 24 eggs and we have four days left. Okay, that's not bad. Iridium ore at Clint's crate. I can do that. I have a lot of it now. Let's go bring these things. Nothing ever happens in Canada. Oh my God, I know, I'm sorry. I know. That's even worse. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, TwitchCon will be in Vegas though. I'm gonna go to the one in Vegas. I saw their, um, this was kind of interesting, but I saw that they're doing sort of like how VidCon does the meet and greet system at their convention, how there's like, um, you sign up to go to people's meet and greets. You can't just have anybody show up. You like sign up in advance. So they, I think so they can better prepare for how many people are gonna be there. I saw that VidCon is doing that for, or sorry, so TwitchCon is doing that in Paris, um, which I think hopefully will be a, a decent system. Oh, I meant to bring more stuff so that I could upgrade my next thing, but hopefully that should work well. I don't know. Um, TwitchCon probably could use an uptick in their security, so. <laughs> Hi, Momo, thanks for the 27 month resub. Hello. Um, hello, hello, hello. How are you doing? How have you been? What are you up to? Okay, I just gotta get all of these things. I wonder how many of the gems I have, I'll have to check. I'll have to check. How did it go? It went really well. I had fun at my meet and greet. It was really nice. Um, it was really, really nice. So hopefully people that went had fun. I always get so anxious about it because like they don't let you spend as much time as you would like with people. 
they're like pushing you along the whole time. Um, and that was like kind of stressful because <laughs> obviously I know they're trying to get it through in a timely manner, but like I would have had more time. I could have been slower with people. So I always feel kind of like guilty about that as it's happening because um, you want to make sure you like have people have a good experience, but hopefully if you were there, you had a good time. Um, but anyway, my favorite part of the meet and greet? Oh, I couldn't pick. <laughs> I couldn't pick a favorite part. Um, that's, that's no good. <laughs> um, there were some fun people that came, like some people brought um, my Stanley plushie. There were two people in a hot dog costume, um, some people in my merch. I got given a lot of bracelets, like people made little friendship bracelets and brought them to me. Um, which was kind of cool. I did not sign anyone's arms, Shella. I wasn't allowed to sign. VidCon said I wasn't allowed to. It was really bizarre because they would be like, this is the thing, right? They said that I wasn't allowed to because there was too many people and it would take too long. So I wasn't allowed to sign. I asked if I could have a pen and they were like, no. Okay. But then like some people, I think would ask them and then they would get handed a, like a secret pen and then they'd be like, don't tell anybody, but sign this. And I was like, why can't I just sign everything then? It doesn't matter. I have enough time. I'm not slow. Like, but so I got to sign a couple things, but I wasn't, but it was like kind of like sneaky. It was really weird. The whole thing was weird. And they had like three people there. They had a real photographer as well, um, taking pictures on a real camera and they would like scan their badge to get them. But anyway, I wasn't allowed to sign things. So, anyway, <laughs> that was kind of weird, but I, I, do, I do understand the need for like them to keep on pace, but I just don't think that it was necessary for, oh, did I leave my, where did my prismatic shard go? I must have left it at home. Hmm. I have to go back and get it. Snowy, I don't know how many people were at the meet and greet exactly. I do know that um, they cap it at 250 people is the max that you're allowed to have. Mine wasn't capped. I think that like there was probably, I would guess like maybe around 200, a little bit less than 200 people there. Like maybe like 190 or something, 180. I don't know. I think Dan saw it on the spreadsheet, but I don't remember what. Did I not bring it by accident? Oh, I didn't. Simsy. Get it together. Um, I want to upgrade my pickaxe. That's step one. Um, but anyway, it was very interesting. Um, have you seen Kayla type? Yeah, see, I can be fast. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm so fast. <laughs> anyway, upgrade tools. Oh, I can't do my gold pickaxe. I don't have enough money. What is wrong with me? I thought I did. I don't have enough money. Oh well. Oh well. Yeah, VidCon's an interesting place though. <laughs> Very fascinating. Yeah, I wasn't allowed to sign things, but you know, the sharks are a lot on the stage. Anyway, <laughs> I don't want to complain about it too much. VidCon did a good job aside from that part. That part was not so good though. <laughs> okay, I need to give this to Clint too, I forgot. There we go, now I can afford to get my thingy. Perfect. Upgrade gold pickaxe. All right. I have not upgraded my hoe or my watering can a single time. <laughs> so I will have to work on that over the next few days. Um, we shall get there. <laughs> what else do I need to do? I needed to give, um, find the shadowy figure, bring Willie a squid, bring Carolina pumpkin, okay. Yeah, I've been to events like VidCon. I've been to TwitchCon a couple times and I went to VidCon in like 2017 and 2018. Um, but it was different because I wasn't a feature creator at those VidCons. Um, so the, like I wasn't like doing panels and stuff. The vibes were different. So 
When you upgrade the hoe, it uh, makes it so you can like hoe a bigger space, <laughs> uh, which is quite quite useful. Um, anyway. Anyway, um, do you know what, guys? I really appreciate you saying um, this about the the shark thing because I it's making me feel very validated in my anxiety about it because I felt kind of ridiculous that I was scared when it was happening because I was like, nothing happened. He didn't do anything, but it is freaky because what if he did do something, you know? Anyway, <laughs> thank you for the validation in that way because <laughs> we're all on the same page. It's scary. <laughs> Um, but anyway, oh, there's something I can help. Um, yeah, I was glad that it was fine and over, so. Anyway, let me get rid of this. But it's okay. It's, um, it's a story now. So it's alright. All is well. <laughs> all is well. Alright, I need to bring... Maybe I could bring a pumpkin for Krobus if I'm gonna go down there. And I can bring one to Caroline too. Carolina pumpkin. Oh, I haven't found Linus's basket yet either. Maybe I'll do that. You're confused, sharks. A guy in a shark costume got on stage during my VidCon panel and threatened to expose himself and then started doing the worm and then got carried off stage by Dream's private security. Cause VidCon security didn't do anything. So <laughs> that's what we're discussing. <laughs> um, that, that is what we're talking about. <laughs> anyway, I don't know. I hadn't heard the worm part. Yeah, yeah. It was scary at the time, right? Cause like, again, what's he gonna do? You don't know. But anyway, wait, were you not the one who needed the pumpkin? Oh, it was Caroline, not Jody. Awkward, sorry, <laughs> wrong character. <laughs> sorry about that, I did in fact bring it to the wrong one. <laughs> okay, well, <laughs> good thing I had two pumpkins. Yeah, I was gonna bring one to Krobus, but evidently not. Evidently not. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna bring this basket to Linus as well. You and your husband bought a house? Really, Autumn? That's such great news. Congratulations. Congratulations. My go-to for marrying in Stardew. Do you know what? I don't really have one. I've been trying to marry everybody. Um, and I'm playing on the expanded mod in this save file for the first time ever. I've never used the expanded mod before. So on this one, uh, I'm just hoping to marry someone new, like one of the new expanded characters. So. Oh my goodness. Um, excited for the Virgin Melissa, when does it come out? Uh, not yet. I need to finish setting things up. We have like a little bit longer until um, my other save is ready to move, so. But thank you for the super chat. What do they call it now? That's the first one I've ever gotten. <laughs> hype chat is the Twitch thing. That's the first ever hype chat. Interesting. <laughs> they changed that um, while I was gone. They added it, so. <laughs> okay, winter. He's gonna walk to the spa at 2 p.m. I'm gonna go there. Um, so let's go there. Yeah, they added it while I was gone, so I didn't really know what the vibes were gonna be like or like what to set it at or anything. So I don't know. Wish me luck. <laughs> I'm still experimenting, but thank you. <laughs> um, yeah, you don't have to do it though. Don't feel obligated to do it because I don't know. I don't want you to spend money on it. Cause I don't know what the, I don't know. Don't do that yet, or, but you don't have to, but I'm still trying to experiment with that one. It's new, it happened while I was gone and I haven't seen enough of <laughs> everybody else's dreams to know what the vibes are or anything. So don't worry about it, <laughs> but thank you. Yeah, Twitch takes a cut of hype chat. They take um, 30%, um, they take 30% of it. So, um, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. That's how much YouTube takes of their hype chat as well. But Twitch doesn't, like, uh, YouTube has, like, the fees included in that 30%, but Twitch makes you pay the fees and takes the cut. So it's, like, more expensive. I think the streamer ends up getting, like, 66% of what you pay, so. 
Um, don't feel like you need to do it. I was kind of going to try not to talk about it, and now it's become a thing we have to discuss because um, I didn't want to encourage people to do it. So. <laughs> oh, I haven't seen my bait cutscene yet. Oh, but it's not a bad thing. Don't worry, Holby. I don't mean to make you feel bad for doing it. Don't. It's not a bad thing that you did it. I just did. I don't want to like encourage people to do it. You know, <laughs> I don't want anybody to think that they have to or anything like that. Um, but thank you for doing it. That's cool that it was the first one. Um, I just didn't want people to feel like they have to or anything. You know, um, I very much appreciate you doing it though. Um, let's go grab some fishies and see if we can get our squid. But anyway, wondered what it was. Yeah, yeah, because it's brand new. Um, basically, you can see it like pins the um, the message at the top of the chat for a certain amount of time, um, and then uh, puts it big in chat as well. Very similar to how um, YouTube's super chat works. So, I mean, it's it literally is like copy and paste of YouTube super chat. If you've ever seen a YouTube live stream, um, you might be familiar with it, <laughs> but. Um, yeah, Twitch added it. I feel kind of conflicted about it, because I think in one hand it's nice for streamers to have, um, another, like, way to earn money. Um, not necessarily me, but, like, streamers in general, I think it's a nice feature to have, but, um, I wish that the cut was maybe a little bit better, or maybe a little bit more transparent, you know? But, oh well. Oh well. It just sucks when you're paying, like, Twitch money, <laughs> you know? You know what I mean? Um, there's my squid that I needed. Bring Willie a squid. I don't think I can do that for you yet, buddy, but I will. I will. You had to stop your laundry machine to get your loop earplugs out of it? Oh no! Oh my god. Do you know what? I washed my loop earplugs too and they were fine. But I also washed mine because I never leave anything in my pockets. Um, but... At, over uh, after my Taylor Swift concert, I had in my pocket, and then I washed it by accident, and they were fine. So, um, anyway, hopefully yours are fine. <laughs> I I wish you the best of luck, my friend. I'm sorry that happened. I did the exact same thing though because I never have anything in my pocket, um, and I didn't realize that I had left them there. You know. Yeah, it's nice. You really, really should bring your plugs to a concert. Like, if you're gonna go and make such a difference having your plugs, highly recommend, highly recommend. Um, but they're not like anything, they're just earplugs. So, anyway, um, keep yours attached to your AirPods. Oh, that's smart. Yeah, that's a good idea. Um, but they're really nice. So. <laughs> It's really loud at these at these sort of events, right? So the earplug helps to protect your ears. You can still hear the concert just fine. Um, if anything, you can hear like the artist better, um, and then it drowns out a lot of the sound of like the screaming, um, which helps. <laughs> so you 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 won't you won't think of things as being muffled. It will be an adjustment for you when you're listening to yourself through them at the concert because you can hear yourself very clearly um and it you're gonna be like wow i'm a terrible singer <laughs> um so that part will be a little bit jarring at first um but it, you'll be glad you'll be glad to have them um that's just how earplugs work that's just kind of how it is but it, it helps to like block out the sound of the the screaming and stuff so that you can um hear the concert better it's good and then it, it protects your ears as well so I would recommend, I would recommend. Um, you always you always use earplugs when going to like get groceries, let alone to a concert. Well, yeah, it's hard. It, the noise is very overstimulating just in general, but especially in a place like that, so. Um, anyway, <laughs> highly recommend if you're going to any concert, earplugs, so. I'm just gonna chop a little bit of wood while it's late and then I'll go. You got loose but got bothered by your own breathing. Yeah, I can see that. I can see that. Um, but I was really, I've, I've been very glad to have them. I bought them for the concert and I realized that it's been really nice to have your plugs for other things. So <laughs> um, 
I appreciate it. The noise, especially, we talk about it sometimes, but like the sound of um, people like leaf blowing and, and doing yard work makes me want to like pull my ears off. It's horrible. Like I can't, cannot deal with it. So having your plugs when that's happening, especially if they're like out here, like in my neighbor's yard next to my window, absolutely cannot deal, cannot deal. So anyway, <laughs> it's helpful, but which sleep ear plugs do I have? I don't remember because Dan bought them. Not, let me look. Loop earplugs. I got. Um, yeah, the, the experience ones. I got these ones in black is what I have. So, <laughs> I didn't know what they were called, <laughs> but I got these ones. <laughs> um, but anyway, protect your ears. It's good to have for live events like that. Definitely good to have. Um, okay. Oh, check this really quickly. What's the luck? Good humor, okay. Sounds good to me. Yeah, I hadn't seen that Solstice collection either. I don't think that was there when I got them before, but now there's pink ones. Are you kidding? That's messed up. What if I want pink ones? <laughs> what if I want pink ones? Um, I'm trying to get all these eggs. This is actually not so good to be honest because I need like a large number of eggs for this thing. I need two more eggs. Sounds good. Sell those. Okay. Give the old ones to Dan in order the pink ones. Well, Dan has them too is the problem. Me and Dan got the same ones. So <laughs> I don't need to give my old ones to Dan and I don't need two sets of them. <laughs> I don't need to have two sets of them, that's for sure. Um, Okay, um, let's see, I want to, ah, sorry, I clicked off my game for a second, it was weird. Signed earplugs giveaway, do you know what? I don't think that anybody here wants my used earplugs. Maybe I'm wrong, um, but I am under the impression that nobody here wants anyone's used earplugs. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> That's gross. <laughs> you are wrong about that. Okay. Well, they're washed. You said it yourself. That's true. My earplugs are washed. They went through the washing machine. That is true. <laughs> oh my. All right, let me get uh, this to see if anything we need is in here. Please a truffle, please a truffle, please, please, please. Stupid, this game is stupid. <laughs> oh no, oh no, 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 no. Okay, um, one second. I think from here, I wanted to look at the community center stuff because we're almost there, but there's some stuff that I can't do yet. Um, for example, I need truffle oil. I have no truffles. I need a fruit. I have no fruits. I need 10 salmon berry or an ancient doll. Don't have either of those things. I need a truffle, have no truffles. I need apples, have no apples. So that's kind of where we're at right now. Um, I want my greenhouse, but I need my truffle for that. So not that good. See, I wasn't as fast with my community center as I normally am because I was so distracted and excited by the like Stardew expanded stuff in this save that I just wasn't. And now look at me, I'm weak and I have nothing. Did you enjoy mini Disney? Oh my God, can I show you something? 
Speaking of mini Disney World, sorry, I know Disneyland is the original. Lots of you like Disneyland, blah, blah, blah. Disneyland has the most weenie castle you will ever see in your life. I need you to see, I'm going to get the picture. I need you to see me and Dan's reaction to when we saw the castle for the first time. Or, well, I had seen it before. When Dan saw the castle for the first time. Because he hadn't been there before. Oh my god, how many pictures did I take? Here we go. So, Disneyland has a tiny baby weenie castle. And I'm sending them to Dan so I can show you. Come on, load. Come on, load. Here we go. Live reaction to your tiny weenie. That's the wrong thing. That's my squid thing. Come on. Well, there you go. Look at this. Sorry, can you see that back there? Can you see it? Can you tell it's there? No, you can't. <laughs> it's like this big. <laughs> anyway, um, sorry Disneyland, but Florida wins this one. We don't win much, but we win this one. <laughs> Castle? Where? I don't see one. I don't see it. You know what? We'll let you have this. <laughs> Disneyland's the original though. Yeah, that doesn't work on me. People will be like, but Disneyland is Walt's Park. Okay. Yeah. Doesn't mean it's good. Just means it's old. And he was a part of it. <laughs> anyway, um... There you go. <laughs> it was funny. It was funny. Okay, where are we going next? Oh, I have to bring this squid to Willy. That's right. Anyway, Walt sucks. Their castle in Disneyland sucks. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. It's like a 70-year-old castle, give her a break. Disney's is 50 years old here. So, I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> I don't know, we still win. <laughs> okay, let me go get rid of this squid, and then I'll figure something else out. No, it was fun. I'm joking about it. Disneyland is quite fun. We had a good time. I just, um... Florida doesn't win a lot of things. Uh, in fact, Florida is a terrible place. So I'll take what I can get, you know? If I can have this one over California specifically, I will. Because they have a lot of things that I want. You know? Um, so. <laughs> okay. Oh, when I was in one of the Ubers that I took when I was in California, the guy was like, oh my God, where are you from? And we were like, oh, we're from Florida. And he was like, really? I've always wanted to go to Florida. You have alligators. I love alligators. And it was the cutest thing I've ever heard. It was so sweet. He was like, have you ever seen an alligator? And I was like, yeah. <laughs> and he was like, I love alligators. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. <laughs> anyway, made my day. I'm not gonna lie, that was so fun. Ah. Stupid fish. Too slow. What do we got? A lost book? I'll catch as many of these little fish as I can get today. And then we need to go back also. I need to make some more um, copper and iron ore and stuff so I can start upgrading my other things. Yeah, I love when people are passionate about things. When people are excited about things like that, it's so cool. <laughs> it's so cool. Anyway, gators are kind of fun, so. Bait. Oh. My bubbles are gone. Oh well. Yeah, it's fun for people to get excited about things they like. I think that's pretty cool. 
I hope he gets to see a gator. Because then he deserves it. Alright. Let me go sell... Oh, maybe I'll sell him straight to Willy. Will I try to catch the legendary fish of winter? Do you know what? I hadn't really thought about it, to be honest. I guess maybe I should. Maybe I'll buy myself an iridium rod. Because, like... We can get a move on. Yeah. I don't know. Let me look at the wiki for a second. I haven't really tried to catch any all of the fish yet. It wasn't a priority, but if we have time and I don't have my, um... And I don't have my, what's it called? Thingy right now, so... Um... We can try and catch the glacier fish at the south end of Arrowhead Island in Cindersap Forest. Requires level six fishing. Where am I? Hmm. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Should I? Is it in the same place in Expanded? Is it at any time? Yeah. Let's go try. Should I bring something for this? Probably. I don't know if we'll catch it right now, but we can see. We can see. Find it a little hard, but you can try it. Well, it's not easy to catch the um, legendary fish. I don't really want to spend a lot of money on buying um, stuff either. So, we could make, that's a quality bobber. I don't really need a quality one though. Increases the bite rate. Mm. I don't want to spend money on any though, because I need money still, so I won't. I will just catch it without it. <laughs> I will catch it without it. Why don't I zoom out? Like zoom out further in game than this? I mean, I suppose I could, but I kind of like it zoomed to, to there. So, trap bobber. Can't I not make that yet? And that's the thing, I don't want to buy one. Oh, I can. Copper bar and sap. Mmm, I can make one. How much copper bar is that? One. I can make myself some of those. I can make myself some of those. How was the plane ride back? Oh, it was good, Paige. It was, um, I ended up switching my flight again. <laughs> I was gonna take a red eye home, um, and I switched it. Actually, it was cheaper when I switched it as well. I got a $25 Delta credit back, so shout out to Delta, but I switched it to be left at 4 p.m. instead of at like 11 at night, so I got home at like 1.30 in the morning yesterday instead of 7 a.m. So that was good. Um, I, I would say that was an improvement. Um, <laughs> I was gonna come home uh, late, but luckily I didn't, and now I'm here. And it worked out pretty well because then the Sims team decided to um, do a live stream today. So, anyway. Anyway. 25 bucks extra. And the, actually, it was 50 because Dan got 25 bucks back too. So there. <laughs> so there. Um, that worked out pretty well. So, anyway. A train is passing through Stardew Valley, okay. I'm making a video for the live stream? I already did, Jenny. I posted it earlier. A few hours ago I posted it. So. Um, now it's live before, am I? No, they, they announced it um, a few days ago, but while I was at VidCon, I didn't know before I left for VidCon that they, had, that they were going to do it, but when I was at VidCon, they announced the live stream. So. Which is annoying of them to do that to me. <laughs> Two day, where am I going? I need to get onto this. Come here. Hello. Okay. <laughs> always when you're away. I know. It's okay. I was here this time. 
All right, we're going to fish and we're gonna see if we can catch a glacier fish. That is my plan. Let's do this. Who's ready? Fish? Oh, do you know what? Actually, maybe in hindsight, I don't want to try. Ah! Hold on. I was gonna say maybe in hindsight, I don't want to try and catch a fish. No! Oh my god, 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 oh my god. Hold on, hold on, hold on. It's too soon after the fish incident of VidCon. Hi, Melly, by the way. Thank you for the read. Bear with me. I'm just trying to. Okay, hold on. I can do it. Just give me a sec. Just give me a sec. I can do it. Just. Oh my god. I don't know if we can catch up today, chat. I might need to get my fishing skill up a little bit higher first. I don't know. <laughs> I can catch it, it's just, I might need a little bit more uh, prep work. This isn't it. This is not it. I have caught all of legendary fish before on stream, but um, without trap is kind of impossible. Oh yeah, it's hard without the trap for sure, but it'll be all right. We don't need to get it right now. We just thought it'd be funny if we tried. Oh my god. Fishy, you're really bothering me with that. I'm not gonna lie. One of your least favorite fish to catch, you respect the effort? Yeah, it's not one of the best, that's for sure. Give me a sec, chat. Hold on. Don't bounce like that. What are you doing? This one's a little bit easier. Oh, shouldn't speak too soon. Shouldn't speak too soon. Oh my god. Stop that! Stop! What is wrong with you? Stop! 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 Oh. <laughs> oh. Somebody says, farming? I need this kind of calm. You know? That's not really how I would describe this moment, but... Anyway, she's out of practice, let her warm up. Whoa, Bruin, yeah, I haven't caught a legendary fish in a bit because I haven't tried in a bit, but I'm also not that skilled. Like my character isn't that skilled right now. Screaming at fish calms you down, yeah. Do you know what, screaming at a fish to stop, given what I went through this weekend is actually kind of therapeutic. You know what, maybe you're right. How does one fish in this game? You're so confused. Okay, so I have to keep the green bar that's moving up and down is me. And I need to keep that green bar on top of the fish. The fish is moving up and down and I need to keep the bar over it. While the, um, the bar to the right goes up and down over- Oh my god! <laughs> Bad example! Oh, not there. Um, I need to get the bar to the right all the way up to the top. Um, and it goes up and down as you have the green bar on it. Anyway, come here, come here, fishy. So do you see, well, maybe you can't really see because this one's like moving quite fast, but I need to keep this green bar under him, basically. As much as I can until it goes, but the, then I only have the, anyway. Anyway, we're not gonna catch this legendary fish today. There's no point in even trying. My fishing skill isn't high enough in game. So, this is a, this is what's called a legendary fish. The other fish are not this bad. Oh my god. Oh my god. The other fish aren't this bad. There's a handful of legendary fish that are like the hardest fish to catch in the game. Um, this is one of the hardest ones to catch in the game. So, we're level 6 right now, Bowl. You only unlock the ability to catch it at level 6, so. We don't need to catch it right now. I wasn't gonna try right now, but that was an easy one. You see how much different that was? Trout soup and bobber would help though. Yeah, I don't have any trout soup. We're not actually, I wasn't planning on trying to do this for real today. I kind of just went here and did it. But we can do some trout soup maybe next time we try for real. This one is not. Oh, careful. Come here. Oh my god, nobody say a word. No one speak. No one speak. 
Calm down. Oh, I had it up high. It was so, it was doing so well. Oh my god. No. <laughs> oh. Anyway. Anyway. See how easy this one is cuz it's not a good fish. The legendary fish are very special. They're not all like that. Don't worry. I'll give it a couple more goes. The first time you caught a fish, you did it by scream singing love story. I don't know why it worked, but it did. <laughs> That's really funny, actually. I don't know about scream singing right now. I need to focus. Come here, fishy. Come here, fishy. Come here, fishy. Come here, fishy. Oh my gosh. Come here, fishy. Come here, fishy. Stop moving. Stop doing that. Stop doing that. Stop doing that. <gasps> that was easy this time. Wait, no one speak. No one speak. Don't say it was easy. Kayla, shut up. Kayla, shut up. Why did I say that? Why did I say that? I'm, lo I'm losing it. I'm losing it. I'm good, 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 I'm gonna catch it, it's gonna be fine. Just stay still for like two seconds. It's really not much to ask. Come here, please. No, don't lose it, don't lose it, don't lose it. I can't read chat right now, I'm sorry, I'm... Now I can. No one speaks as the only one speaking. Okay, well, when you put it like that, <laughs> I flopped. Yeah, and as I get my fishing skill up in game, like the more you fish, the bar, you, your bar gets bigger. Um, so it does get easier. I'm just only level six, so. It's not that easy to catch when you're only level six. Well, it's not ever easy to catch, but you know what I mean. Come here, fishy. Come here, fishy. I think I'm doing a little bit better though, now that we've been warming up today. Oh, spoke too soon. Fishy! Calm down. Is there like a pattern that you can practice for this or is it? I wouldn't know. Come here, fishy. Oh my God. Are you seeing this? I hate you. 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 It's any of the fish patterns? Okay. That makes sense. No pattern, just pain. Makes me feel better though. <laughs> okay, come here, fishy. I need to stop looking at chat because I'm like not paying attention to this. I'm making it take longer. Anyway. Level 9 and you cannot catch it. It's hard, Evie. Don't feel bad. Even like level 10 fishing with trout soup and stuff, it's hard to catch. So don't feel bad about it being hard for you to catch. That's the point. They call them the legendary fish for a reason. You're not alone in that. Oh my god. I got a Steam notification, so I looked down at it and I distracted myself. <laughs> You can't be looking at steam notifications, Kayla. You're catching a fish. Come here, little one. Come here, little one. I want to catch it so bad. It would mean the world to me if I could catch it and be done with this. I mean that when I say it. Oh my god. I didn't even think I was going to try to do this today, and now here I am, and now I'm like really, really committed to it. Just stay still! I hate when it does the big giant moves. Oh my god, please! <laughs> please, 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 please! Please! What are you doing? Oh my god, I hate this fish so much. It's not even the hardest one of the legendary fish to catch. Ah! I was so high in the green and now it's ruined. I just want it to be over. Okay. It's fine. This is fine. This is fine. It's 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 fine. Oh my god. What are you doing?
You thought it was the hardest fish to catch? Oh, is it the hardest one to catch? Oh. Well, in that case, I'm a pro. Scream at the fish. <laughs> you feel like you're watching sports right now. You're at the edge of your seat. This is. This is a sport. That's not even the one. What are you then? Drama. Come here. Finish. I want to catch the legendary fish. My fishing tackle has worn out. Uh oh. <laughs> okay. So. <laughs> That's enough for today. That's enough for today. <laughs> we need the tackle. There's no point. Close call between the, glacier fish, between the glacier fish and the legend, but you hate the glacier fish more, really? Yeah, I haven't done legendary fish catching since my perfection run, so I don't remember my strong negative opinions. I feel like I feel like the legend wasn't that bad for me to catch either, but I don't know. Sometimes you get lucky. Anyway, um, we'll see about this. Do I want to do it tomorrow? Maybe not. Hard to say. <laughs> Hard to say. Maybe we'll get our fishing seal up more though. All right. Um, I'm gonna grab all of my little guys here. I'm gonna make some more of them overnight. They only take like two seconds, so I don't really need to do it overnight, but weird to see grass in the winter. Yeah, I know. I, this is my first time ever playing with the expanded mod, so it's weird for me too. <laughs> I'm with you. It's also weird for me. Um, put those in there. Okay. Okay. Sell, 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 sell. Nice. And then we go to bed. Hello? An explosion was heard at the railroad. Oh. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Level seven. Cool. All right. That problem is solved. Let me look and see. Do I want to try and catch it again? My gold pickaxe is ready, so I can go upgrade my hoe today. Spirits are neutral. What do we got? Want me to bring Emily her favorite stone. Okay. Um, I'll take this. I'll take this. Will I next play Animal Crossing? Um, maybe next week. I'm not sure. Um, a new chick hatch. It looks odd. <gasps> My void chicken. What should we call it? What do you want to name it? Thoughts? Fish. <laughs> Hello, little one. Hello, chickens. Good to see all of you. Okay. Very nice. I've got my chicken. I have now the 24 eggs that I need. I need to bring myself even more eggs than that so I can put it in Gus's fridge. Okay. And then, oh, why did I forget to it's like I stopped making cheese for a while. What's wrong with me? Okay, let's get our milk. <sighs> In we go. Hello, little ones. Good to see you all. Am I marrying a villager? Yeah, we're gonna marry, I think, one of the new NPCs from um, the expanded mod, but I haven't decided who yet. You have no milk right now? Oh. Okay. 
Bye. But yeah, I want to marry one of the new expanded mod NPCs. I'm just not sure which. <laughs> we'll see. We will decide. Okay, I'm gonna go upgrade my hoe. I also need to potentially craft... Um, increases the bite rate. The cork bobber increases the size of my fishing bar, which might help me. Wood, hardwood, and slime. Yeah, it's a mod. It's not DLC. It's a mod. Um, there is no DLC for Stardew. Um, I make myself two cork bobbers. Okay. Um, I need to bring 24 eggs. Yeah, let me just go do that now. Okay. I'll get this too. Clay. Uh, being a me, little chicken. Thank you guys all for the subs and stuff, by the way. I'm sorry, I know I didn't read them. I was very distracted by the fish and now I don't know what's going on. But thank you. <laughs> Much appreciated, thank you. Um, oh, I guess I can't go in there until noon, huh? Well, that's fine. <gasps> Bread! Let me grab, oh, can't grab this because you're there. Oh, hi, Marlin. Interesting that you're there. We're doing the community center, not Joja. Yeah, we're doing community center. Um. Okay, let me go pick up my pickaxe. Thank you. I will put that here. Then I will upgrade my hoe. Good. We can also upgrade the watering can and then we'll do them into an iridium. We got this. Plenty of time. Okay. Okay, I have pickaxe. Should I go to the mines or something while I wait? Cause I have to wait until, uh oh, sorry, <laughs> yawning. I have to wait until noon. I just made all of you yawn probably by accident. My bad. <laughs> My bad. Okay, let's go to the mines just for a bit. I'm gonna need to get myself some more iron. So I always need more iron in this game. Literally constantly. I can't wait till I have an Iridium pickaxe. Oh my god. I want to get my hoe and stuff upgraded a little bit more and then I'll go for it, but that will be the day. Once I have that upgrade, life will be good. Any little bits of iron just until noon? Thank you. We can do a Skull Caverns run soon too. Might be fun. What is it with iron in these games? I know! I feel like in every game you need so much iron. For everything. It's horrible. Oh, that's open. Mm. Mm. Hey, Naive and Phoenix, thank you for the subs, both of you. Take this. I think the Skull Caverns are so fun. I love doing the Skull Caverns. Great time. Hello. There we go. There we go. How much is that? 27? Okay. Um, I need a little bit of copper too. That might help. Thank you. All right, after I do the next level, I'll just leave. We got 31, which is more than I had before today, so. Been there once, Dynasty never came back. It takes some It takes some serious prep work and practice to do the Skull Caverns. Um, I can try, when I go there later today, I'll, I'll try and give you some tips. How about that? Um, we'll see if that helps you at all. Because you can do it. You just gotta be extremely prepared to go into the skull caverns <laughs> so we'll talk about it we'll we'll discuss hopefully give you guys some tips um no 
I'll just leave from there. Maybe I'll kill the slime. Trying to kill a lot of slimes. We're gonna have to work on um, the slime ring stuff soon too. All right, let's go to town. And then I will give Gus his eggs. And then, I don't know, we'll see. <laughs> we shall see. Um, okay. Hello? Where does he want them in his fridge? Okay. Hi, Gus. I am here. I'm gonna give you as many regular sized eggs as I can. Gus's famous omelet! Yes! Easy quest. Easy, easy, easy quest. Nox just died from the robotics machine while your sim was tutoring? <gasps> uh oh. Well, that's no good. That's no good. Um. Thousand pieces of stone in a week, 80 hardwood. Do you think it's worth doing that one for Robin? I don't really want to. Should I? I could probably get it. Uh oh. I have to collect the 80 pieces though. Gives you a bed? Yeah. Yeah. In two days? Yeah, we're gonna have to do some collecting, aren't we? I can get it tomorrow though. Maybe I'll try and do a bit on the way down as well. Cause look, on my farm, I think I have some hardwood trees. <gasps> this is the person. I think I might date Claire. Either Claire or Sophie, but I'm not sure which one. They're both very cute and they both seem very nice. One of them has pink hair. So that's kind of a win, I will say that. Um, okay. Yeah, we'll go to the secret forest and stuff, exactly. We've got some places to get. Oh, maybe I don't have the hardwood on my farm that I thought I did. I thought that I had some hardwood trees up here. Evidently, I do not. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Could chat vote on who to marry? No, because... I don't want chat to give me, I know that some of you like know stuff about the characters because you've played before. I wanted to decide after I had seen more of their cutscenes. Um, that's kind of what I was thinking I would do is try and like see more about them and then decide. Um, you know, just so that way I can pick for myself. Anyway, Maddie, Sadie, Aspen, Willow, thank you for the subs everybody. Um, Claire's your fave only because you two work a soulless job at a grocery store. Oh, well, you know what? I'm glad that you like Claire. I'm sorry about the Jojo business though. Ooh, Bearberry. I think Claire is cute. Who was the first person that I married in this game? I actually married Harvey first. First ever person. He's a doctor. I think I chose well. <laughs> Seems to be doing well for himself, so. <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get all the hardwood that she wants me to. Ah. I don't know. You have a bad sunburn on your nose? Oh no. When I went to, um, Disney with Sasha and Steph. I got a sunburn. Oh, something's in my eye. I got a sunburn on my scalp, like in the part of my hair, which was not so good. I did not enjoy that. Cause then when I like took a shower afterward, it was burning down the center of my head. Ouch. Ouch, 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 ouch. Oh, and you wear glasses. Oh no, I bet that hurts. I'm sorry, and you've got a sunburn on your nose. Ouch, 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 ouch. I'm really sorry, that sucks. That really sucks. Hopefully it clears itself up soon. Okay, getting a sunburn is the actual worst. That's horrible. 
Okay. Um, I don't think that we're gonna get enough hardwood. <laughs> don't think we're gonna get enough. Yeah, sunscreen is so important. So, so, so important. Yeah, and then it looks like you've got dandruff when the top of your head is peeling because you burnt the top of your head. Yeah, trust me, I know. Anyway, I had a sunburn right in the middle of my head. Ouch. I need to start wearing a hat. Um, okay, anyway. <laughs> I'm gonna go try to um, catch this glacier fish. I can do it. <laughs> hey, Cinder, Angie, thank you for the subs. The head sweat is gross. Yeah, but head sunburns are worse. Where am I? This isn't where I want it to be. You spray sunscreen on top of your head? Yeah, you got to, don't you? That's the thing. Ouch. Is this modded? Yeah, I'm playing with the expanded mod for the first time ever. So. I had a lot of errands to run today, and it took me longer than I expected it to. Where am I? What am I doing? I need to go this way. Oh my goodness. Oh, Kayla! Hello! Oh my god, Kayla, I meant to tell you, I was very excited to share that um, the merch of yours that I bought has shipped. Me and Dan both got a hoodie. Wait, that's where I need to be. What am I doing? I'm losing it. Hi! <laughs> we're, um, we're playing a little bit of Stardew Valley. I was gonna go try... I'm only level f 7 fishing skills, so I don't think we're gonna catch this, but I was gonna try and catch the Glacier Fish Legendary Fish. Chat, if you haven't seen my friend Kayla's merch, um, you should. It looks really good. The, uh, we bought, me and Dan both bought the Moody hoodie. I'm really excited about it. Oh my god, can't talk much. Can't talk much. Can't talk much. Oh my god, can't talk- okay. <laughs> anyway, hi. <laughs> thank you for the raid. And Sam and Chip and Alex, thank you for the subs. Um, I'd get a link, but I'm fishing. Anyone have a link to Kayla's merch? Anybody? Anybody? <laughs> No, well, yes, I wasn't actually trying that hard to catch it right now. I didn't bring any food for any buffs. I was just gonna kind of wing it. Um, your hoodie hasn't shipped yet, your own one? That's so funny. Um, but yeah, I was just gonna kind of wing it um, today because I don't have much time to fish today. See, it's already 9 p.m., so. There's Kayla's merch, candidlykayla.com. You should check it out. It's cute. Very, very, very cute. That is not a fish. Come on. That's not a legendary fish either. Hmm. Hmm. It's a bream. But isn't the Moody hoodie cute? Yeah, you should get one. <laughs> oh, oh my God. Oh my God. Okay. Well. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna be um, catching this today. Okay, just chill for a second, all right? I need to use the other bobber. This one sucks. This one makes the bar bigger, but. What I need to be is level 10 fishing skill and have the other trapper thingy. Oh well, I don't need to catch it today. I'm just trying to kill time until all my stuff is fixed, so. How was VidCon? It was really fun. I um I had a meet and greet, I had a panel. Some guy in a shark costume jumped on stage during the panel uh, and then threatened to expose himself and then got carried off the stage by security. Um, so that was an experience that I had. Um, yeah. You seen the video? Yeah. Uh-huh. It sounds funny. At the time, not funny. I was quite scared. <laughs> but it was, um, yeah. And it was Dream security guard. It wasn't, it wasn't like VidCon security. It was Dream's private security guard that like picked him up and carried him off the stage while he was like flopping like a fish. Yeah, that's the thing. You don't you don't know what they're gonna do, right? Like in hindsight, he didn't do anything to harm anyone. But like when it was happening, 
you don't know what they're gonna do. You don't know what he wants. Like, you don't know what his intentions are. So it's scary. Anyway, um, luckily we were all okay and stuff, but it did, it did freak me out. <laughs> it did freak me out. Hope he was banned permanently. Oh, I, I think he definitely was uh, kicked out of the event for sure. Um, and they would be very stupid to not permanently ban him after that, so. Um, but anyway, yikes. <laughs> Otherwise, it was a good time. It was a good time. Um, but that was kind of freaky. Um, maybe I'll catch one more. It's already midnight. I shouldn't do this. One more fish, one more fish, one more fish, one more fish, one more fish. Oh, you're not a legendary fish. Anyway. Well, any extra fish are good because that gets our skill up a tiny bit higher, which is good. Um, just watched it try to flop around and got picked up like a little kid. Well, I can show you again. Literally, he, so what he did, I'll tell the story again in case you guys weren't here. Basically, he walked up to the stage, and I'll explain it to you from my perspective, all right? He walked up to the stage, and there's like, kind of like at concerts, there's like a fence, a gap, and then the stage. You'd think there would be security at the front of the barrier. There wasn't. Anyway, he walks up, and he starts leaning over it and like yelling at us. And then he climbs the barrier, climbs up on stage, and then... Um, he started yelling stuff like, have you ever, this is kind of icky and sexual content warning. He started yelling, have you ever seen a fish's balls before? Cause he was in a shark costume. And then he like grabbed himself and I thought he was gonna get them out, he didn't. But I was like, are you gonna like expose yourself on the stage? And then he was like, suck on these yelling. And then he like started doing the worm. And then that's when dream security came up and uh, carried him off the stage as he was literally like flailing around flopping like a fish but I'm not kidding when I say flailing like look at that flailing anyway and he was in a shark costume so that was interesting um <laughs> Uh, but luckily everything was fine. It was okay. And then we just continued the panel as if it was normal. Like, Dil like Dylan was like, okay, so next question. And we just continued on. Which I think is what you're supposed to do. It's kind of like how you would handle like a troll on stream, you know? Like you just don't address it because they want attention, but it's weird. <laughs> really, really, really weird. But anyway. There's my life update from VidCon, so. <laughs> anyway, the flailing bit's funny, not the rest though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I think in hindsight, it's funny. You can laugh. It wasn't funny at the time, but it's funny now because everybody's fine, so. <laughs> if people were hurt, it wouldn't be funny, but everybody's okay, so. Um, the panel was called I Dream of Streaming. So, did I enjoy being on the panel? Yeah, it was fun. I was quite nervous about it. I felt a little bit, um, as though I didn't belong. <laughs> I was like the only girl in this uh, panel of like quite big creators and like, um, I was like not the same size as them, you know? So it's like, I felt a little um, anxious in that way about it, but it was okay, it was fine. Everybody was really nice and Thought it went well. I don't think I came across as nervous. My voice wasn't even shaky, which was impressive for me, I think. Um, so <laughs> that part's a win, I guess. Um, but anyway, all is well. Gotta let go of the imposter syndrome. I know, Lizzie, I know. My first year in story is almost over. If you keep buying seeds from me, you'll be twice as productive next year. And I have some exciting news. You'll be selling new seed varieties in your shop next year. Yay! I'll be there. I'll be there. You know, I wouldn't even bother trying my competitor seeds. Pierre's seeds are the highest quality seeds you'll find anywhere. That's a promise. <laughs> I understand. I understand. Um, oh, I got a fridge. And tomorrow's the festival of ice. Okay. Oh, I got an extra fridge. Oh, I got an extra fridge. Um, cool. Cool. 
All right, so I will take this, put that on there. I'm not sure I'm gonna finish Robin's project. <laughs> I don't think it's possible. That's okay though. Um, I need more storage, don't I? Um, seeds, okay. Want to look today for the skull caverns? Oh, we could go to the skull caverns today, I suppose. Hold on. Queen of sauce, plum pudding. Spirits are in good humor. Oh, we will have extra luck today. Do you want to try and go to the skull caverns? I think that I will. Let me just get everything kind of organized here. I have no space in this. Um, do I have any bombs or did I use them all? I might have used literally all of them. I believe I did. I believe I did in fact. <laughs> did I get the quest reach level 100 yet? No, I did not. I did not. Sid, Courtney, Abby, Angel, thank you for the subs. I have reached level 100, but I haven't gotten the quest to reach level 100 yet. Um, well, yeah, I'm gonna craft some bombs. I just don't wanna have to, <laughs> I just don't wanna have to waste everything. Um, let me get some, oh, we're running out of solar essence. Oh, that's okay. I'll make like, how about five of these? Yeah. And then I'm gonna want to make, this is why we've got all that iron yesterday. I'm also running kind of low on coal. That's okay though. I used up all of it. Ah! After this, we're gonna have to be very careful. <laughs> okay, that'll be fine for now. We've got 23 of those. Actually, probably won't be fine, but should we just go for it? Maybe, maybe. Hey, Bree and Beth and Sid, thank you for the subs, everybody. Um, bring my jade. Oh, yeah, 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 hold on, let me get it. We can trade it, it's Sunday. There you go. Um, Jade, maybe I'll bring some rubies too. That'll be good. I need to go to the traveling cart though. That part's kind of important. <laughs> I really need to go to the traveling cart so I can see that nothing important is there. Okay, this way. I do have a chest at the Skull Caverns, yeah, but I don't usually use it because I tend to just pass out in the Skull Caverns um, instead of bothering- <gasps> You guys, we got the greenhouse. Okay, <laughs> finally! Oh my god, I've been trying to get a fruit in there for so long! Okay, we got the greenhouse. That's like, we're like 10 steps ahead now because we can finally get that built. I'm gonna actually go put that in there right now so the greenhouse will be here tomorrow. It's worth it. It is very, very, very worth it. Oh my god. Even if we're late to the Skull Caverns, I don't care. I have, I don't really even need to go to the Skull Caverns because I have like loads of stuff, but... Um, maybe I just bought six packs of Amiibos at Target, but that's not your business. What series, move? Also, hi, thanks for the 52 month resub. That's ridiculous. One, three, and five. Oh, nice ones. Um, okay, 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 okay. We are eating good tonight. Two of each, one, three, and five. Those are good ones. Oh, I'm so excited! Okay, here we go. Greenhouse. Yes! <laughs> yes! I needed that so bad. Oh, I got a keg, which I don't need. But. Yay! 
Your two and a half month old is obsessed with Kayla stares at the TV intently when she's on. Really? Oh, that's so cute. That's so cute. That just made my day. Absolutely made my day. All right. I want to watch him take this. Look at my little star for my little Junimo. We're almost done. It's just the stupid bulletin board. <sighs> we'll get there. It's fine. As soon as the greenhouse is built, we can um get a move on. Your cat swats it, Kayla, so there's that. Oh, good. <laughs> oh, good. Do you know what? Maybe I should try and buy some, um, today's not a good day for the skull caverns, is it? No, but it's okay, because like, I need to try and buy some star fruit too, for the greenhouse. Um, life will be good if we can get some star fruit in there. Money, 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 money. But, Let's go to the desert. I guess I could go back to the desert tomorrow if I have to. We don't need to get the star fruit. We can buy it tomorrow. Okay. Could you have dropped me off closer to the desert trader? That would have been helpful for me. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Um. I got myself some more spicy eel. We can get a couple staircases. I can trade iridium for mega bombs. I have loads of iridium. I should have thought about that. It's okay. That's okay. We shall be good. I'm ready to game now. Am I dropping frames? No, I dropped 0% of frames just now, so we should be okay. Might be your internet, Lily, unfortunately. Might be on your end. All right. Let's get going. Shall we? Die. Okay, so here's my tip number one for the Skull Caverns, all right? Step one, you need to come in here with really good stuff. You're gonna wanna have a large number of bombs and you're gonna wanna have a lot, and I mean a lot of good food. Things like cheese and stuff like that is pretty useful. Um, the reason I have that spicy eel is because the spicy eel gives some bonuses. I get plus luck and plus speed. Um, you can trade for spicy eel uh, with the desert trader. And then your goal, literally, and I'm, I'm not exaggerating when I say this, your goal is to get down out of these caverns as fast as humanly possible. Like you, want to just put bombs everywhere and get out of this place. Your goal is to get down as fast as you can because that way you can get more iridium out of it. I'm not being that fast right now, but um, you want to get down from here as fast as physically possible because um, that's how you, how you get the most out of your trip. Because the farther down you are, the better stuff you get basically. So I, sometimes I don't even bother, like mining stuff is too slow. I wouldn't even usually bother with stuff like that. Just bombs. Estimated number of bombs? I don't know. I, like, I feel like I don't have enough right now. I would like bring literally as many bombs as you can make. If you're gonna try and do a serious run, only go on like a best, best, best luck day and bring as many bombs as you can. And as soon as you get a ladder, go down. Even if you didn't get everything off the level, just go down is if I could offer advice, it would be that. You can be try like some people, like the people that are really good at this game, they're a little bit um, like more, they just kind of place bombs everywhere and anywhere, but you can be a little bit more careful with it. But you want to bring a lot of bombs. I don't have that many on me right now because I didn't have a lot of iron, but you want to bring a lot. Because your goal is to try and get the most out of your trip down here, you know? So you want to bring as many as you can so that you can get the most out of it. Yay! See, and that's a hole. Jump in those when you see them, because that might give you more than just one level. I fell five levels just then, see? Pretty good. Oh yeah, and those mummies, you can only kill them with bombs. Those mummies don't die from, um... You have to, like, kill them and make them be, like, a pile on the floor, and then hit them with a bomb, and then they'll die. <laughs> Which is kind of weird, but that's how it works. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have come in here today because I don't really have enough stuff to make it worthwhile. But it's okay. That's okay. We'll try and get some of our 
resources back at least. Die slime. You think luck has no effect on the skull caverns? I think the luck, I mean, it affects how much drop you get from like the iridium ore and stuff. Um, so it does have some effect because it affects the drops of those things. Um, I placed that too close to me. Oh my God, see, I'm wasting all my bombs. And it affects the rate of the ladder drops too. Um, oh my God. On a better luck day, you get ladders that, there we go. Drop it more often. So this is the kind of level I would just straight skip this. It's a spiral, it takes too long, it's not worth your time. Cause you only haven't, hi snap, you only have until 2 a.m. So sometimes with levels like that, that are a, a spiral, I just skip it. Won't even bother. That's why you can make the staircases for it. Um, oh, <gasps> mega bombs. That's actually really good. I was told that sometimes you can break these and it's a another ladder or a hole. Snappy, are you here to help me? We're doing quite well. Not really, <laughs> like level 22, <laughs> it's not that good. Um, okay, hi Snap. I think the chat missed you Snap, did you know that? I think they missed you a lot actually. <gasps> ah! Oh my God, I was trying to put a bomb up there, I wasn't paying attention. Forgot I don't have a slime ring. <laughs> it's been a while. Uh, Vidalius, you're trying for Australian tour tickets today? Oh, you got this, Bestie, I believe, I believe. Um, and Curious, and B, and Beetlejuice, thank you for the subs. How many levels was that just then? Were you paying attention? Die. There we go. Eight? Oh, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. I could use this gold. Thank you. Very nice. You're stressed trying to get them? I know, the tour ticket business is no joke. It's horrible. You got this though. I believe you will get them and you're gonna be so happy and have the best time. Everything's gonna be great. I'm just gonna skip this level because there's a ladder right there and I don't wanna waste a bomb. Okay. Taylor's not coming to your country. I'm really sorry. I'm so, so, so sorry. That stinks. I hate these kinds where they're so spread out. It's stupid. Why? Well, I, just, I just wasted a bomb. Did you see that? How ridiculous of that. Was that? Oh, Kayla. I'm falling apart. <laughs> Dutch, funny, funny. Thank you for the subs. <laughs> Planning on calling in sick to, to work when the Europe tickets come out? No, I respect that. I don't blame you. That, I mean, you're prioritizing your health, you know? That's so valid. One million people signed up for the Sydney presale. Oh my God. Ah, it's amazing. It's amazing how in demand these tickets are. It's like actually really quite impressive, I think. Okay, how much iron do I have? 31 and 15 coal. We can make some more bombs. Oh, did you look at that? Five levels. Yeah, and people are willing to travel for it. You know, that's the other thing is that people like will up and fly far away to go to these concerts. So it's very, very, very in demand. Okay. Oh, there's a hole. Yay! Yay! Usually I would get this, but that one's gonna be a thingy, see? Little crab. Um, we had a way more successful run in the school caverns last time. I got to like level 120 or something. Today's not as good. <gasps> a hole. Hi, Snap. Do you think my cat likes Stardew? I bet she'd like to watch the slimes, to be honest. I can imagine you liking this, Snappy. I don't wanna waste my bombs. Hmm. 
Let's use a big one down here, because there's a lot of iron. Hello. You hate mining in Stardew? Oh, you hate but love mining in Stardew. No, I'm with you. I really, I actually really enjoy the Skull Caverns. I think they're kind of fun. I actually kind of like them. Um, this level sucks. This level sucks. Why am I not getting anything good? Hello? Let's use bomb down here. I can get that coal. So that'll be something. <laughs> that will be something at least, right? Oh my god. Why? I hate when they're this spread out, because you can't justify placing the bombs as much, you know? And I don't have I don't have enough bombs to be just like throwing them around right now. I only got 11 or this is a flop uh flop skull cavern run i wish you guys were here for my last one when i streamed it la last week it was so good i got three prismatic shards in one day great fun great fun oh my god i'm starting to think there isn't a ladder oh never mind sorry <laughs> but dutch thank you for this that was both of you sorry spoke too soon it was a good run though you were here? Well, there you go. You don't know if you'd call level 54 a flop? Okay, fair enough, Christine, but. Thought I got four? I got, well, it was three in one run and four in the day before. But three in one run in game. Technically. If we're being specific. But it was three in the one day. Oh, good. 57? Die, stay away from me. Thank you, oh my god. Battery pack, that's pretty good actually. Thank you. Please give me something good, give me something good. Oh. Come here. My cat is being so cute right now. I think she's kind of thriving at this moment. Um, I am ever so slightly regretting coming down here. <laughs> but it's in the upper left. What, the level? Or what? Yeah, that's the level that we're on, is the upper left corner. Um, die. Die. Oh, the hole. Oh, yeah. It probably is up here. <laughs> Let's be honest. It almost definitely is. And would you look at that? It is. I want to get that iridium, though. Stay away from me. I need more solar essence, actually, so that's pretty good. Maybe I can make a um, little baby bomb with copper. Okay. That's not bad. Um... I don't want to waste any more bombs. I just—I should just go for it. I should just go for it. Everything's fine. Ooh, that's where I want to be. How many levels are there? It's—it actually goes on. The skull caverns go on indefinitely. Like you can keep going; they don't end, um, which is kind of cool. So it's—it's it's unlimited. Um, in the past, I think the lowest down I ever got was like 150 or something close to that. So, is it a new part of the game? No, you unlock this. Um, after you get to the desert, you can go into the skull caverns. So, after you have the bus, you can go. Oh my god, I suck. Snappy, I can't see, I can't see, I can't see. Okay. <laughs> How do you get out? You can just hit the ladder up. There's a ladder down there. You can just hit that ladder up and get out from there. Okay. Die. Die. Oh, I didn't. I need to eat more spicy eel. Okay. 
Okay. Time for you to die. It's 11 p.m. How late am I going to stay in here? That is the question. That is the question. That one is going to be, I think, a uh, crab. Or no? Maybe not. Okay, never mind. Never mind. My cat has just rotated and now she's fully on my arm, so I cannot take my hand off the keyboard. <laughs> Unfortunately, my hand is stuck on the keyboard. <laughs> It's a good thing that I got it in the right place. <laughs> I lived in that bag. Um, Allie, thank you for the subs, everybody. Oh my. Yeah, this level's a flop. I don't want to waste my last... I want to use my mega bomb in like a good mega bomb type spot, you know? Oh. Just go. How far down can we get? That's seven. Minor to go to sleep before 2 a.m.? Well, you actually don't have to... Uh, Vito, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stay here until 2 a.m. If you pass out in the mines, nothing bad happens to you. Um, all, all that happens is they take a little bit of your money, but it caps at a certain amount, so they won't take that much of my money. Um, and I feel like it's worth it to stay in the mines a little bit longer, because I've spent all this time and resources. Um, and the longer you stay in the mines, the further down you go, and the further down you go, the better stuff you get, so. I, I think it's worth it to stay down here. Uh, and just let myself pass out. It won't take any of my items. Just my- just a little bit of money. And I think that, like, spending the extra money, essentially, is worth it. I'm not doing an infested level. <laughs> but you see what I mean? Like, in, um, this specific context, I think that it's worth to stay and waste, like, a thousand gold. It won't take that much. Just- just up to, like, 1k. So. Ends up being worth it, I feel. Um, let me just go down. Hello. Oh my god, stay away from me, slime. Is there anything good down here? It is in fact 1am, which is not good, but that's okay. That's okay, stay away from me. I'm gonna need to make another one of those. Oh, this level's good. Nice. Okay. If all we get is like the rest of this level, that'll be fine in my book. Come here. I want the diamond too. Please, 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 please. Okay. There we go. Take this. Come on, I want to get all the stuff. And then I'm gonna go down. I probably should have just gone down, but I I want I need iron and stuff, so I gotta pay for my bomb somehow. <laughs> All right, three levels. The final level of the day. We got 79. Not the best, but we did all right. I'm not gonna really get those. Can I get the iron at least before I pass out? I got one. There you go. Nice, <laughs> Katie Master. Thank you for the subs. See, it takes a little bit of money, but oh, <gasps> in my greenhouse! Yes. Oh, I'm so excited about that. I am so, so, so excited about that. That means we can start planting stuff in there. Life's gonna be good. I need it. All right. Barely any money today. <laughs> I didn't sell like anything. I want this game so bad. It's fun, Bumblebee. I love Stardew Valley. It's such a good game. I really like it so much. All right. Why did I click that? I wanted to click Fortune Teller. Spirits are in good humor today. All right. Um, right. I'm going to try and make myself some more Iridium. Um... Oh, inventory full? Oops. Oops. Okay, one thing that I know I need to do, um, and I was at least originally planning on doing, is I wanted to um, try and redo my farm a little bit with some Iridium sprinklers. So I think that's gonna be goal for today, is to start working on the sprinklers. <gasps> I need that duck feather. Oh, maybe I don't need it anymore. Do you know what's so annoying? I think I needed that duck feather for the bundle that I finished yesterday. <laughs> 
So if I had kept that pomegranate, then I would be able to have that duck feather for, and the pomegranate for another one of the bundles. Cause I need another pomegranate still, but it's okay. <laughs> That's okay, it's fine. Now that my greenhouse is built, we can go buy um, some of the thingies. I need to get us some like, uh, what's it called? Trees. Okay, I got built a thousand gold for passing out. That was worth it though. It was worth it though. Okay. Okay. The space, thank you for the seven month resub. Oh my god, Snap is like fascinated by this. She's staring at it so intently. I think she likes it. Do you know what I need to make is another chest? I've got all this like random stuff in here. Let me get a chest that I can put like the furniture and things in and old tools. Cause I'm sick and tired of having these things that I don't need in there. Okay, put the, um, Sorry everyone for making you watch me do this. I'm just focusing. All right. I wanna just shove all of, no, not you. All of these things away. Just for now, so I have more space. Okay, Um, let me put that away. I can stay down there. I can put these in there. Okay, Allison, John, don't thank you for the subs. I can put this duck feather in here. Save it for a rainy day. All right. And then I guess from here, after I finish grabbing this stuff, I'll go buy my trees. I need an apple tree and a pomegranate tree, I believe. So that'll be good. And then we could also probably go, all, although I might need to try and sell some stuff to get a little bit of extra money. <laughs> um, but, um, I think, oh, my pigs are grown, so that's good. But yeah, we'll get the pomegranates and everything. Because we need to have, hold on. I need to have pomegranate fodder bundle. Wait, have I not bought a rabbit yet? Oh my god, I need a rabbit still. Uh. Oh. It's a festival today. That is extremely inconvenient for me personally, I must say. <laughs> I gotta be honest, that is not helpful. <laughs> that is really, 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 really not helpful for me. Okay. I have so much I need to do. I don't want this right now. What can I sell? No, keep that for now. So we've got more stuff for tomorrow. Um. No. That doesn't belong in there. Maybe I'll sell these mushrooms as if that's gonna make literally any difference at all but you know what it's worth a try <laughs> go away i'll save that all right all right nixon solo thank you for the subs how to have all the new items in the horse ranch ep well yeah but i don't really like talking about when like the full i never talk about um when the whole item list of things come out, I don't usually talk about them until after the pack is out because I prefer to wait until the pack is out so I can see it for myself for real. Um, but the the items are listed on the EA app for the horse pack. I just don't really, like I never do that. It always happens with kits too. I never talk about them. I try not to look at it until it actually comes out because I, like I like to see it in game, so. Anyway. Um. I'm gonna see about selling 
like a handful of things. Always want to see all the swatches. I know, it's like you want to wait until they're out for real so you can see the swatches and stuff. But anyway, <laughs> it happens a lot. I usually just try not to look at it that closely because I prefer to wait and see because I find it kind of fun. So, all right, fishing tournament. Everybody who's ready? I am. Okay. Do I want any of these things? Does anybody like pumpkin soup as like a fave gift? Sebastian loves pumpkin soup. I can buy him some. Maybe I'll buy some stuffing and some cranberry sauce. It's all cheap, so I might as well. Yeah. Hello, Susan. Hello. Hello, Evelyn. Hello. Who am I dating? I'm not actually dating anybody yet. I'm thinking about dating um, Sophia. Also, maybe Claire from the... Here, look. This person. Isn't she so cute? I mean, come on. So. Leaning a little bit towards dating her. That is my thought, at least. Okay, hello. Hello. I want to go in there. But then there's also Claire. I don't know if she's here. But I also like to maybe date her. I don't know. Harvey, Gus. Hello, Marnie. Everyone over here. I'm excited to do my fishing game. Except my cat's on my arm. <laughs> that's gonna inconvenience us a little bit, but that's okay, she's here to help. She is here to help. I think she really likes this game. She's like totally in awe staring at the screen. I do think that it seems like the kind of thing she would like though, because of the little tiny people moving around. I, I can see why it would be intriguing for her to look at, you know? I get it. What kind of snowman should you make? Oh, something funky. Love that, Penny. All right. Last but not least. Hello. Hello. All right, I am going to do the ice competition. Okay, Snap, you gotta let me focus, all right? This is serious. I better win. Let's begin this year's ice fishing competition. I'm ready. My goal is to get as many fish as possible, blah, blah, blah. Am I ready? Yes. The end. If I don't win, I'm gonna cry. I'm serious. Come on, give me a fish. All right. Wow, really difficult fish, huh? <laughs> no! Well, no, this is like a special festival that's happening in game. It's like a holiday in the town, so. Why am I not catching any fish? Bunch of trash. Bunch of trash. Unbelievable. Yeah, I'm using the modded version of the farm. I have, I'm playing with the Stardy Valley Expanded mod for the first time ever in this save. Uh, and I've got like a modded version of Grandpa's farm that comes with Expanded. I never used mods um, before this save, so. That's what we're up to though. Fifty seconds, I've only caught three fish. But I've caught every single one of the fish I've been offered. I'm just not getting a lot of fish. That's not fair. It's just slow. How am I supposed to win if they don't give me any fish? It's rigged. It's rigged. Oh. Things are improving. So it's fine, maybe. Maybe. 
20 seconds. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Okay. We're going to have six fish. Do you need seven to win or six? It better not be seven, because I was only given the chance to catch six. Otherwise, it's not fair. Oh, Sophie, thank you for the sub. Sorry, I thought I said that already. Maybe I didn't. And, and Maurice as well. And Amber, thank you so much. It's right. That's a lot of fish. Yeah, it sure is. Gag the smell. I think it's five. Oh. Maybe I did win then. Kayla with six big slimy fish. My prize. Chance of finding treasures. Make your catch more secure, causing the fishing bar to cling to your catch. Works best on slow, weak fish. I don't need slow, weak things. I'm trying to catch the legendary fish. Okay, let's go. Always reset if you don't win. I, I respect that, I do. All right, I won. I won. I'm gonna make myself, here, let me put these tools away. And then I'm gonna make a little bit more iridium overnight. And then I have sort of a chest of like gift things. That's trash, not gifts. <laughs> I can start trying to turn these trash into stuff. Um, and then tomorrow, we need to start working on redoing our farm, making the iridium sprinklers, buying the seeds, buying a rabbit, stuff like that. Because I forgot I didn't buy a rabbit last time I played and now it's been days and I still haven't bought one. And my copper hoe is ready. Sounds good to me. Okay, we'll collect everything as well. Oh, it's Tuesday, so I can't get a bunny. Marnie, it's ridiculous. It's fine, everything's fine. Oh, I got my first void egg though, that's cool. How about that? What year am I on? This is year one, Renee. Uh, we are in winter of year one on this save. Cool. Is there a mod to make Marnie do her job, right? Marnie is literally everywhere, every time, except her house. She'll go anywhere but her desk. Okay. Um, put the cheese away for now, too. And then I will turn... All of these milks into cheese. I will get this so I can milk them again. Yeah, I'm gonna get them. I have to go to Pierre to buy seeds too. Chicken, don't worry. That is the plan. Oh, I can't milk you today, can I? Oops. Oops. Hello. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Back from your break? Well, hey, welcome in. It's good to see you. We're gaming. All right, I have to pick up my hoe. Should I upgrade my... Hmm. I guess I... I'm gonna need the watering can if I'm gonna, like, do all of that. But also... I guess I could just not water them today and they'll get watered tomorrow from like default, right? If I upgraded my watering can today. What I'm saying is because I'm gonna plant um, stuff in the greenhouse, but it's okay if they like don't get watered till tomorrow. If I get my hoe and then I, yeah, okay, I'll do that. I'll do that. Watering can, copper bars. Go start there. 
Nice. Easy. I can take these as well. I'm gonna make myself so many kegs, and then we're gonna be rich. <laughs> Brooklyn said, uh, Millie, Lexi, Amber, thank you for the subs, everybody. All right. Hello to my friend, Pierre, because I need to buy stuff from you. Specifically, I would like to have an apple sapling and a pomegranate sapling. And the rest of them I will add to over time. <laughs> I cannot really afford to buy much else right now. <laughs> Um, yeah, we're gonna play Among Us on Thursday, Mar. So in a couple days we'll play Among Us, yeah. That is the plan. Okay. I need my hoe and then you can have my watering can. Thank you. Upgrade tools, watering can. Good. And then I can put my saplings in there. I wanna show you guys, Snap, I can't really type because your hand's on my thingy. I wanna show you guys uh, some like greenhouse layout type of stuff. Cause I wanna try to like maximize the, um, but look in the greenhouses, cause you can plant, in case you didn't know. Bye Snappy, thank you. In the greenhouses, you can plant trees around the edges um and so we can put those in there and then we can grow fruit in the middle i'm gonna put some of my coffee beans in there so we'll get that started um but yeah we have a lot of stuff that we can grow that is the plan that is a packed greenhouse yeah you gotta make the most out of it you know um, which we will do <laughs> that is our plan <laughs> Yeah, preserve jars is quite smart in there, actually, I think. I hadn't really thought about that. But once they're grown, because then you can put the fruit in there straight away. Um, oh, do you know what? Should I go straight to the... I have to spend some money on this, but I think it'll be worth it. I'm going to go straight there, and then I'm going to buy some star fruit. That'll be good. Itsy Bitsy Thunder, thank you for the subs, both of you. Um, yeah, you can do that in Vanilla Stardew. That's not modded. You can do that just like normal. Oh my god, the shop's up here now. Not we're used to the expanded mod still, but yeah, you can do all that without mods. That's normal. Okay. I cannot buy that much star fruit. I can, in fact, only buy 14 star fruit. <laughs> but I think it'll be worth it. We'll get some money started that way. Yeah. Snap, what do you see her? Oh. Maybe she'll sit in her chair. Don't acknowledge her, because then she might actually sit there. If we look at her, she'll come over. I'm saying it as if you have to do that. I, you can look at her, I just can't. If I look at her, she's gonna come over to me and that's not what we want. I want her to sit in the chair so I can put the cat cam on. Prehistoric tool. No, 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 on the chair. <sighs> Snap. Okay, put that in there. I'm gonna have to steal some of these. I'm gonna turn these into iridium sprinklers, so. Be able to use them in the greenhouse for now. All right, my greenhouse is so far away. Uh. All right, all the way over here. I guess we could start chopping some of these trees too to clear us up some space. Was it necessary to go on it from the back? Oh, now she's gonna go behind it. She's thinking about going behind the chair. I don't know how well you can see her, but. <laughs> no, Simsy, don't look. No, it's okay. She's being nice, it's okay. All right, I'm gonna put my pomegranate. How, should I put it like, 
Because you can lay them out. Should I put it on the edge? Here's the question. Should I put it here or here? Do you think it's more beneficial to me to have it on the complete edge? She just ditched us. How much space in between it? Two or one? Two squares. Okay. Okay. And then I will put this here. Oh, I need to get myself some fertilizer, don't I? I can't even water these right now. <laughs> I don't have a watering can. That's okay. That is okay. Slowly but surely, we will have this all filled out. Oh, don't like how that's placed, but oh well. And then I'm gonna get my coffee beans too. That'll be good also. Good. <laughs> Rain Wolf, thank you for the sub, by the way. Thank you so much. Can you expand the greenhouse? No. We cannot expand the greenhouse, unfortunately. That would be cool, but no. Krobus sells Iridium sprinklers on Fridays, by the way. I know, but I um I don't have enough money to spend on the amount of Iridium sprinklers that I want. So we'll have to craft the iridium sprinklers. I have to get, I might need to actually make myself some more gold bars, but I have, oh, good thing I noticed. We have some battery packs. We have a lot of iridium. We're just slowly, slowly, slowly getting back up there. We've got loads of iridium though. So we should be okay with that. My money is gone. Yeah, <laughs> I don't have any money left. <laughs> I spent it all, so we will actually not be um, uh, able to buy any. So <laughs> I'm investing in star fruit at the moment. And the, the trees are quite expensive as well, so. All right, void mayonnaise. We can get started making some more mayo. Yeah, no spending 10,000 gold on a sprinkler. Not for us today. We don't, we don't quite have enough money for that, actually. Probably not gonna happen. <laughs> Benefit of growing star fruit? Oh, it's just expensive, Char. I didn't get my fertilizer. It's just expensive. So you get some good money. Eventually, I'm gonna have all ancient fruit in there. I just don't have any ancient seeds yet. <laughs> So I can't do that. Um, fertilizer. I have speed grow. I have tree fertilizer. I don't have any regular fertilizer. Oh, sorry. Yawned. I'll just make some basic fertilizer for now. Think rare seeds sell for more than star fruit, by the way. Well, yeah, I don't have, um, I guess I have a couple rare seeds in there, don't I? Um, we could probably start planting those as well. Um, and then oh, I can sell that, that's money. Go away, go away. Do I have a seed maker? Yeah, yeah, we will. We shall get one. I haven't crafted one yet, but it's not hard. I haven't needed one yet. So <laughs> now that we're actually working on the greenhouse, it's time. <laughs> Um, gold bar, wood, and coal. Coal, gold bar. Seed maker. I'll make a chest for over there. Put those things away. Okay. Feeling quite good about that. Um, all right. Yeah, you can't mod Stardew on the Switch. You can't mod games on the Switch. Um, so you can't do that. If you wanted to play with mods, uh, Switch probably isn't the best 
uh, platform for you because you can't really do that, unfortunately. Um, okay. Cool. Look at that. Multiple at a time. Um, you can though if you connect Switch to PC. You guys, you can't mod a Switch without like hacking it. <laughs> so my point still stands. You can't really mod Switch. <laughs> Okay. It's not really the same as like on PC where you can um, do anything. <laughs> uh, there's, it's not really, it's not really feasible, you know? Okay, cool. Those things are planted in my little greenhouse and I have no money left. <laughs> uh oh, hey Morgan, Cosmo, Sarah, thank you for the subs. No, Nintendo would not be happy if you did that, that's for sure. They're quite, um... Let's say this. Nintendo is quite dramatic. Um, about... everything. <laughs> everything, so... All right, put that away, that too. I have some of these extras that we can sell. Um, you, 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 okay. Hey, Mar, thank you for the sub gift. Thank you, th thank you so much. Um, you, I guess there's some of this stuff that I could probably sell. Um, like, oh, maybe not. That doesn't belong in there. What are you doing in there? Maybe I'll try and turn. Oh, do you know what I should do, actually? Let's make hops and cranberries in. Oh, maybe I'll just do hops in these for now. Because I have loads. Okay. Okay. That's easy. Thank you. I will put a duck egg in there. Maybe I'll just keep some of the regular eggs, but sell most of the regular eggs. I'm trying to get a little bit money back, you know? I'm not doing the best when it comes to money in game right now. I spent it all, so. Okay. Um, sell, sell, good. Good. Now we need to probably, I'll just pick these all up for now. I can make five of my things. So let me grab batteries and this. All right, I'll get my iridium sprinklers and everything's gonna be so good. Um, should I try and scoot it over one? I probably could, huh? Try and maximize the space over here. Um, okay. Go away. Because I could probably, if I really wanted to, I could probably have this be lined up down here. It's just like... I don't really love um, how it looks on top of the white. So maybe I don't want to do it there. Technically you can, but I don't like it, so. <laughs> Tess, I want to thank you for the subs. Oh my goodness. We're gonna be so set for the spring season. Yeah, I'll put it down this way. That's better. Okay, so these iridium sprinklers, they water two tiles on each side. So one, two, like that. Um, and I'm going to, I think, so it'll be there, 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 and there. Let me just clear this up a little bit. Sorry for making you watch me do this. Um, so one, two, one, two, which means this needs to be a sprinkler. 
and then two tiles down. This will be where I put the thingy. Yay, okay. <laughs> Got that sorted. I'm excited about this. It's always fun to like fix up the farm a little bit, you know? <laughs> It's gonna look so nice when the new season starts and we're gonna have all of our pretty crops. Um, all right, go away. Go away, got Stardew on Switch recently so you've been binge watching a lot of my old Stardew streams. Oh, I hope you have fun with it. Stardew is such a fun game. It's so good. It's just, it's one of my like all time favorite games ever. I just have so much fun playing Stardew Valley. I really, really, really like it. Am I playing tomorrow? Oh, we're gonna play Sims tomorrow. Um, what did I say I was gonna do in The Sims? Building, maybe? Yeah, we're gonna build in The Sims tomorrow. <laughs> That's what we're gonna do, is build. All right, so we need this to be five tiles wide over here. That will be good. I want to remove, like, move my chests a little bit too, because I'm not really obsessed with where my chests are located. Um, I want to like organize them a bit better, because then you can, I can use my thingy that I have to craft straight out of them. Okay, this is three, four, five, so that it should be here. Yeah, because this will go right there. So this will be. Up this way. Okay, sorry. Got it. Got it. It's getting late. Oh my. Oh my. Okay. Wow, I have a lot of sprinklers to make. <laughs> this is gonna take us ages. Um. All right. Cool. Can I make some more of those? Yay! Ten. Okay. I'll just go to bed. I'll just go to bed. Leo Sorbin, thank you for those subs. Thank you so much. All right, bedtime. Yeah, Willis, I think I'll finish our university build tomorrow. Um, and then, um, and then we'll uh, work on something. I don't know what else we'll build tomorrow. We'll figure it out. We shall see. We shall see. Okay. Hello, happy Wednesday. Just in case I didn't get Queen of Sauce. I did know how to do Queen of Sauce. And today the spirits are very displeased. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> okay, well. <laughs> that's fine. I will not go anywhere then. <laughs> Yikes. Um. Great day to organize the farm. Yeah, it's a good day to stay home and work around the farm. How about that? All right. Oh, let me grab these again. Um, I think I might end up trying to make like, so I might need a few more Iridium sprinklers. I'm not sure exactly how many I want, but I want a lot. <laughs> okay. How do you get money? Uh, selling stuff, farming, things like that. Do I have that already? Yeah. Bunny time? Oh, I do need my bunny, but I don't have enough money. I spent it all yesterday. The rabbits cost 8,000. Can I scrounge up another 3,000 today? Probably not. Because what would I sell and to who? Store is closed. Oh no. That's not very good, I must say. I'm a little bit alarmed. Fish? I guess I could fish this morning a little bit. Yeah. 
Enough to get 3,000. I guess I could go do that now. I suppose. One, two. Oh my goodness, look at how many sprinklers I'm gonna have. Everything's gonna be so beautiful. I should probably go do it now though, huh? Before it gets to be too late in the day. All right, let's go fish. We can do that. We can do that. Hey Sid, thanks for the 18 months. Polo as well, thank you so much everybody. Um, okay. Okay. If I get two hearts with Caroline, send you a recipe for tea cell, which sell for 500 each. Do you know what? I forgot I haven't talked to Caroline much. I don't think I've given Caroline, oh, I guess I do have two hearts. I have, maybe, maybe I have to get the cutscene first, right? Um, that's fun. How's Dan's foot? It's good. He's been doing a lot better, um, which is lucky because he was in a lot of pain a couple weeks ago, but he's better. He is better. All right. I need 3,000 gold <laughs> from fish. I can sell some of these little shells. How about that? That's a place to start. Um, maybe over here too. Interesting. There's quite a few. Probably not 3,000 gold worth, but again, it's a start. We can do that. All right, what about you? Nope, went to root, okay. Okay. How many fish do you think I'm gonna need to catch? We shall see. I'm gonna sell this to him first. Hi, Willie. Take these. Okay, 2,000 gold worth. I'll stay right here. Um, R4, I usually stream for about three hours, so I, I'll probably get off in like 20 minutes or so, depending on where I'm at in the day. Um, I don't need to use my bobber right now. I don't want to waste it. Um, but yeah, depending on, maybe I'll play an extra day, you know? Time flies when I'm farming, I'm serious. I have so much fun with this game. <laughs> I love Stardew Valley. <laughs> it's so fun for me, I love doing this. Absolutely makes my day every time. A sardine. Useless. Okay. Come on. A little bit of extra money. Can do the clay hack at the beach for clay money. Well, the thing is, I need the money today. That's why I'm fishing, so I can sell it straight to um, to Willy, because I need the money today so I can buy uh, the bunny today. Because Marnie is very annoying and never there. That's sort of the situation. <laughs> so I'm trying to fish so I can sell it back to Willy quickly, basically. Um. Best way to get trash? Oh, go fish in the mines. Um, like, you know in the mines how there's, on the certain levels, there's like the lava water um, and stuff like that? Uh, go fish in the mines on one of those levels um, and you'll get a bunch of trash. Like a lot of trash. So. The mines are full of trash. Fish in the water in front of the spa, you only get trash? There you go. I need a lot more money than this. On your, sometimes on your own farm you get trash out of the pond too. But. Oh, I just wanna have it today so badly. So, so, so badly. I need the bunny to start growing. It's so important. Okay. 1500 is a lot. Oh, I can fish in those bubbles. Save time, save time, save time, save time, save time. Oh, hi, Re 
Hi, welcome to the stream. The vibes are immaculate. That's really nice of you to say. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Well, this one's so hard to catch. <laughs> wow, that was so difficult. <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> anyway, these bubbles are um, pretty useful. The bridge by Clint's has the butterfish and the popfish, they sell, they sell for so much. Do you know what? Yeah, with Expanded, I haven't uh, caught that many of those yet, but you're right, that's true, they do sell for a lot. Um, it's okay, if I need to buy the bunny tomorrow, I can buy the bunny tomorrow. But, I would like to buy the bunny today, if possible. You love when I play Stardew? Thanks, I love playing Stardew! <laughs> and me, Sophie, Apple, thank you for the subs! Um, Iridium probably fish sell for like 7,000. Oh wow, okay, well now we know for next time. I don't think I want to fish that much today, but... I'm hoping I can do the bare minimum. For this right now. Once my seeds grow, mark my words, I'm gonna be good. I'm just not there yet. <laughs> I'm just not there yet. I got my greenhouse stuff planted. You know, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Come on. Come on. Wow, these bubbles have been pretty useful, haven't they? They just keep coming. Oh, and it's done. <laughs> and it's done. Okay. I think anyone here have good mods for Stardew and play on Mac? That is a good question. Anybody in chat may be able to help them? <sighs> that is not enough money. Not enough money. What do you think I should do? I don't want to fish anymore, because it's boring me. That's so mean. Maybe I can sell that fire quartz to Clint. <laughs> Some of us are getting desperate. Bring Emily and Amethyst. Oh, I can do that. Oh my god, that'll get me some money. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Emily, I'm gonna bring you an amethyst so I can have a little bit of money. Oh, I can't sell it to you! Ugh! I hate you, Clint! I forgot my watering can. Now what am I supposed to do? Cry? Give up? This is the worst day ever. <laughs> Apple, thank you for the 19 months! Did I sell it already? I don't know. Probably. Probably. Okay. Take all of you. Whatever, I'll just get it tomorrow. It's fine. I wanted to try and speed up the process, but I don't think it's gonna happen for us, and that's okay. You can't have everything. No, we can't sell to Pierre because it's Wednesday, so he's closed. So we can't do that. Annoyingly. Okay, let's go. But it's okay. I'll get my bunny tomorrow. It's just because I meant to get the bunny last time I streamed this, and I forgot. And now I've played for like three more hours <laughs> and still forgot. <laughs> so, um, oh, my giant omelet. Very special occasion. I'll re it from a dear friend. My world famous giant omelet! Zesty bell pepper, juicy tomato, rich mushroom, and tangy cheese, all enrobed in a blanket of rich fluffy eggs. Dig in, folks. Never seen this? Oh, it's from one of the quests. Um, so I, I did his little egg quest to give him a bunch of eggs, and now he's got this. The mushrooms are a tad chewier than last year. That's rude. Is that a good thing? Go 
good. Good. I did see the Sims behind the scenes thing today, Alex. Yeah, I made a video on it earlier. Um, so I did see it. These eggs are so rich and yellow. Marnie, these from your place? No, they're mine. You can thank Kayla. Thank you. Big eggs. Oh, because my farm is called Big Farm. <laughs> Forgot about that. Hello, Emily. This is for you. It's from who? Oh, you got it at Clint's? Well, I don't care where you got it from. It's beautiful. Thank you. No! I did not get it at Clint's. I got it for- I didn't get money from that either. Never mind. I did not get it at Clint's though. I'll tell you that much. That's mine. I got that for us. <sighs> Clint. <laughs> Clint didn't do anything. I have to do everything around here. Okay, let's go. Let's go. I'm gonna go back to the house and finish organizing the new thingies, I believe. That is my next plan. Okay, I have seven of those. I think that what I would like to do, one, two, three, four, hold on. So I want this to be right here. Okay, so I think what I'll do is try and put a handful more of these in, which will be nice, right? Because we can do like the same thing that we had before. One, two, three, four. Is that right? One, two. Oh, good. That fits really well, actually. I guess, I mean, potentially we could try and get enough of these to fill up everything. But, like, look at how good that is. One, two, and then I'd have one, two. That's a lot of farm. Like, a very, very, very large amount of farm. But you know what? It's doable. I only have five battery packs. Oh, I need four more. Wait, that's fine. Oh, that's fine. Okay. Wait, look. Oh my god. It is a big farm. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> um, I think that I would like to get a little section of like, can you plant stuff on this section or no? What I would like to have is a little section of like, um, flowers that I can put bee houses around as well. But anyway, this is going quite well, I think. <laughs> this is very, very nice. Let me sell. The whole farm is tillable and expanded. That's exactly what I needed to hear. Thank you. That's perfect. Okay. Um, so maybe what I will do is put, I kind of want to have like a, maybe I'll put my flowers up here then. Should I put this here behind this thing? <laughs> I don't know. How about that? But there would be like basically, and we'll need to make a lot more bee houses than this, all right? I only have two. But I would do some like really pretty flowers like that. And I'd have bee houses around it. Oh, and the bear can be next to the honey. There you go. See, it's like I planned it. It's perfect. Okay. Sounds good to me. All right. Um, I guess the last thing I want to do is make some more of these little thingies. I need some more paths. 
Um, maybe I'll have that there. I don't know. I don't know. Look at how much nicer this is. I'm so excited. We're gonna have to buy so many seeds. We have to start like really saving up before the spring. Cause <laughs> if I wanna actually use all of this, we're gonna need a lot of seeds. Yay, okay. That's good. Very nice. I'm gonna need to take these two and like replace them. Have to reorganize everything. Um, take this. Where are all of my extra torches? I probably could make some like actual lanterns soon too, but I don't really have enough money for that. <laughs> or enough battery packs, I guess is the bigger concern. Okay. Um, well, look at that. It's brighter, it's pretty. I think I'll probably put Scarecrow there. Oh, do you know what I'll do? How about actually, let's do a Scarecrow here. One of the rare crows. And then another one over here. And then we can put some like Small scarecrows. I might need to add more than this. I'm not sure. We'll see. We shall see. When spring comes, I have to put ducks near the river so they can swim. You're right. That would be so cute. We'll have to do that. All right. That's all taken care of. I have these lightning rods. Should put this all on the fence because it looks nicer. Well, yeah, Molly, I agree. It does look nicer, but. I'm not um, properly decorating this right now. I'm more just like getting some stuff laid out. Once we put fences in, and it'll all look nicer once we actually have fences in, obviously. But we're not we're not quite worrying about the fences situation yet. We will though. I'm trying to see what all I can sell from in here, to be honest, because some of this. Oh hi. Some of this I have loads of that I don't need. Okay, let's go from there to bed. Penny, logical, Avery, thank you for the subs. It is now going to be Thursday and I can get my bunny. There we go, that's the money we needed. <laughs> Jamie, thanks for the 15 months. Atomic as well and Arden, thank you all so much. Hi Snappy, are you back to play games with us? And my copper watering can is ready. Um, hello. I learned how to make salad. <laughs> Cute. I'll take this. Take this. Get all of these. Oh my goodness. That's gonna be some good money. No, the kitty emotes aren't based on snow. <laughs> I don't think she's that golden, they said. <laughs> your emotes look nothing like your cat, Kayla. <laughs> no, they're not supposed to be her. They're an orange cat. Uh, sort of a old time stream meme. I used to want an orange cat really, really badly when I was younger. Um, okay. Let's see. I think I want to get rid of this too. And then I will put some of this away as well. We'll sell you and you and you and I'll just sell all of that to be honest. Okay. Okay. Always wanted a calico cat. They are so cute, aren't they? Yeah. I'm with you. That's adorable. All right. Make that. You have a buff cat, she's like a cream color. Yeah, my parents have a cat like that. Um, his name is Lemon. He, his name came as Lemon <laughs> when they adopted him, but um, he's kind of like blonde almost. Um, sort of orangey, but kind of like blonde. He's kind of cute. Um, 
looks a bit lemony, dare I say. Um, I'm gonna sell all of this. Okay. Hello to all of these things. I have some goat's milk so I can make some goat cheese. And then I will milk the cows. Cool. All right, and then we have to go buy a bunny. That is the plan. <laughs> Everything is going great. Everything's fine. Okay. One. Oh, Seb, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. That's really kind of you. Got this. Okay. Okay. Oh, really, Dizzy? That's kind of cool, though. That's kind of fun. Um, all right. I will just turn this into some cheese. I like to be making cheese constantly, so I've got enough stuff for me to use at, um, in the skull caverns. <laughs> I think it's nice to be able to eat the cheese in the skull caverns, so. All right, Marnie, I am here because I would like to purchase a rabbit from you. Thank you. What should I call it? Um, Stanley Cheese Larry. Larry! I've never had a rabbit named Larry. Okay. I can sell these eggs right back to you though, which is pretty useful. I suppose I probably should buy the heaters that I never bought. So, <laughs> I probably should start there, actually. <laughs> Oops. Oh, do I have that already? No, I don't. That's good. We'll go to the museum next. Who called me a rabbit? No, it defaulted to, like, Tilky or something. It was, like, close to Tilly. But it wasn't quite Tilly. Tilly. It was almost Tilly. That's why they said that. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm gonna give you all this heater. There you go. Oh, it was Trilly is what it defaulted to. There, almost Tilly, but not. See? <laughs> See, there's some really random default names in this, isn't there? Okay. There you go, now you can be nice and warm. Let me say hi to my new bunny. Hi, Larry. Good. Good. Um. Make some more duck mayo. Do you think that I should, I guess I won't have enough money. It's gonna be like 5,000 to upgrade the next thing, huh? So I probably won't, but I will go and donate these both to the museum and pick up my watering can. How about that? Good, good. <laughs> can rabbits have babies in the game? I don't know, maybe, not sure. Into town. I want my watering can, please. Good, slowly upgrading. Slowly but surely. I can't believe I didn't upgrade it all sooner. <laughs> Doing terrible. Um, the bunnies can't have babies in the game. That's really interesting though, I guess. I didn't, I don't know. Cause coops only do egg incubators. Oh, that's right, there you go. Donate to museum. I have two things, one, two. We're doing quite well in the museum. Look. Only missing a couple things here. Missing quite a few artifacts still, but... Overall, we're doing okay. We are doing okay. Okay, um, after that, I'm probably gonna get off stream here at the end of this day in game. Oh, I want this to be done so bad. This enchanter's bundle is gonna be the last thing we finish. Um, yeah, I think I'll probably get off stream at the end of today in game. But we've done, I think,
pretty well for ourselves. We made a lot of progress. I'm so glad to have the greenhouse. A thousand pieces of stone. 25 gold star vegetables. I can't do that right now. I have no seeds. It's winter. What a ridiculous request. Oh, maybe I could go try and bring some gifts to people. Um, hello. <gasps> I missed Sebastian's birthday. Oops. Oops, 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 oops. Yeah, seriously, Pierre, it's winter. Can't be growing you things like that. Hmm, okay, well, let's go give some gifts. Sorry to Sebastian for missing his birthday, and it makes me feel guilty. Saga, I'm not dating anyone yet in the game. I'm thinking about dating, um, there's a couple of the new NPCs from the expanded mod that I'm thinking about dating. Um, one of them being that pink hair girl we just saw in there, Sophia, and also, um, I quite like- let me show you. Uh, I also quite like Claire, who works at Jojo Mart. She's cute. So, one of them. I think I will date, but I haven't decided yet. <laughs> I'm not sure. Alright. What can we go bring to people? How about... I do have pumpkin soup for Sebastian. Um, everybody likes these fairy roses. Um, maybe I'll bring some poppies too. Wait, bring that. Or maybe you could bring like a couple of these cause they're, bring a summer spangle too. I have beer. I have a couple of those things. Okay. A mosquito just bit you? Oh no, Tilly, that sucks. No diamonds for them. How about amethyst? Anybody like aquamarine? People like eggs and stuff too. Um, okay, this should be enough gifts for now. This should be enough. Sarah, Julia, thank you for the subs. Hi, Pam, this is for you. Sorry, it makes me feel guilty bringing that to you, but you know. I thought only Penny liked poppies. Does nobody else like poppies? Let's find out. It's possible that only Penny loves poppies. It is just Penny who loves poppies. Anybody from Expanded though? Cause I want the... Um... Do you know? I'm like looking at the... Hmm. Penny loves poppies. Yeah, but anybody else? There's an expanded wiki. Yeah, yeah, but I, I don't know. Let me know if anybody else likes them. Because I can bring one. Caroline. Okay. What do you want, Miss Caroline? Do I have anything for you? I have a summer spangle. You're going to love this. Here you go. You're welcome. All right. See, this is the kind of thing I'm talking about. Olivia. She's new from expanded. I don't know what she wants. I have not a clue. Olivia likes <gasps> wine, blue moon wine, chocolate cake, pink cake, golden relic, prismatic shard, and pearls. She's okay with sunflowers. Do I have one here? Oh my god, she's fancy. <laughs> Megan Zebra, thank you for the subs. Um, Sam, I don't think I have anything for you though, unfortunately. I, I've got uh, nothing that you're gonna want. I do have a fairy rose for Miss Evelyn. Hopefully you like it. Um, I was just trying to talk to you. I think I see Sophia down there. She loves fairy rose too, right? Yes, she does. You don't wanna speak? Oh, I already spoke to her, that's why. Okay, um, Mayor Lewis, are you in here? No. No. 
How about in here? I think that I have nothing for you, but I can maybe get a Joja Cola for Sam. Here. Everyone besides Penny hates poppies. Oh boy. Okay, won't be giving those out then. Oh boy. Um, I don't have anything that Gus is gonna want. I guess he likes, he does like things like mushrooms and stuff, but I don't have any of those on me, so I might not give anything to Gus today. I don't think, I, did I bring any daffodils? Oh, wait, I did. There you go, Gus. No, dandelions, that's right. Okay, I was like, I just had it open. He likes dandelions, not daffodils. I don't have any dandelions on me, just daffodils. Uh, let me go see about giving Haley this sunflower. How about that? Oh, maybe I could get a winter root or whatever. Because he likes those. Yay! Gus is going to love that. Okay. Well, no, he won't love it. He'll like it, but... <laughs> Good enough. Oh! Cutscene. I just can't get this jar open. Should I help? He actually does like daffodils? I swear I have it open and he doesn't. Are you sure? Are you sure? Maybe is it, is it a universal like, is that why? I'm trying to open a jar. I don't think I can get it. Did I get it? I'm stronger than you. Look. <laughs> Anonymous, thank you for the sub gift to Ulrich. He has it on the wiki? Oh my god, I'm in neutral. Oh, I scrolled past because he just has one thing that he likes. I was looking at his things that he's neutral towards. That's why. I skipped past this section and I was like, this. I thought this is what he would like. Never mind. All is well. He does like daffodils. <laughs> Sorry, everyone. I wasn't reading it. I was streaming, so I was just looking at pictures. <laughs> um, my bad. <laughs> That's okay. I can bring him that again. That's fine. That's fine. Up this way. Um. I have quite a few things left to give out as gifts as well. Hello, my friend. Penny is the one who likes poppies, right? Yes, we decided it was Penny. And nobody else. Oh, I have a gift for you. Help. You're welcome. Penny, she's sitting right here. I have this for you. Um, Leah, what do you want? Anything I have on me? Leah likes poppy seed muffins <laughs> and goat cheese and salad. I don't really wanna give her anything expensive though. She would probably, oh, she likes winter roots. Here, I can give that to her. Here you go. She said I've been eating a lot of bread. Relate. <laughs> Relate. Okay, I'm gonna go into um, Joja Mart as well. See if I can give some gifts in there. What about, oh, that's Alex. I thought it was the other guy. I'm not used to their new outfits. <laughs> Oops, Alex, I'm not gonna have anything you love. In fact, I don't have anything you even like on me. Sorry. <laughs> Maru, I maybe can get something for you. This is such an interesting little detour, so sorry everybody, bear with me. <laughs> um, I don't have anything she likes on me. Sorry, Maru, you're complicated too. 
I do have a hot pepper for... You are Shane, yeah? Okay, sorry. I had the seasonal outfits mod, and I'm, I'm still- I haven't, like, really seen their winter outfits that much yet, so... I'm not that familiar with their winter outfits from the mod. Okay, and then... On the wiki... I want to make sure I give you a gift that you like, Claire. So I have to go to the expanded wiki. Claire likes flowers, but specifically she loves sunflowers, and I already gave away both of them. Dang it. Dang it. Sorry, Claire. Unfortunately, maybe, do you think she wants a fairy rose? No, she didn't. Well. <laughs> well. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> I gave out quite a few gifts. Should I go try and get Sebastian in his house? I don't think he likes me enough. Uh, I'm gonna go up. You do love sunflowers? I think sunflowers are so beautiful. Abigail. Here you go. Is everybody happy? Look at how good we're doing. Well, not with everyone, with some. <laughs> with some. <laughs> no, you can't give Claire gifts unless you have the expanded mod, because with the expanded mod, it makes her an actual NPC. So she's why, as part of why I'm thinking about marrying her. Because she's, like, really an NPC in this mod when normally she isn't. Um, I just think it's kind of fun. But we'll see, I guess. All right, Robin, I don't really have... Anything you're gonna want. I should have brought some eggs or something. Um, can I even get down here? No, sorry Sebastian, I can't give you your gift yet. <laughs> what about Demetrius? Do I have anything for him? I keep looking at the wiki as I'm doing this, just to triple check. Um, no, I should have brought him some mushrooms though, huh? Okay, well that's fine. I think my gift game is over. Um, maybe, well, I guess in case anybody's in the bar, I can go to the bar, too. Alex likes eggs, too. Well, pretty much everybody likes eggs. I just don't have any eggs on me. The eggs are a pretty much almost universal-like, um, but I don't have any eggs on me, <laughs> so. I was gonna try to, um, I was selling them all, so I didn't, I didn't carry any around. <gasps> Gunther. Oh my god, he's out in public. What do you want, Gunther? Oh, he loves, like, fancy stuff. Oh my god, he, he only wants artifacts. Bessie. What am I to do with that? Oh my god. Should I go back and try and get him something? I don't think I have anything for him. I didn't know he was gonna be out and about. Should I get him, does he like eggs? Is he okay with the universal likes or is it too dramatic? I sold so many random extra artifacts too. Oh no. He likes low, oh he likes diamonds. I could get him a diamond. Okay, let me try that. Let me try that. Okay. <laughs> Faye, Ulrich, thank you for the subs. Oh, sorry, anonymous is sub to Ulrich. And we also have uh, Fruit Loops with the sub as well. No. I don't think he's gonna like eggs. He doesn't have it listed as one of his likes, but he will like the diamond It's on the thingy. I think I have one artifact. I thought I sold it. Oh, I have a prehistoric tool. I thought I had sold that already. That's why I checked the selling box. Prehistoric tool is one of his likes. Well, I could give him that and give somebody else the diamond then. Okay. Hi, Snap, are you scratching your ear? My cat is sitting here. I don't know if you can see her. <laughs> She's hanging out. 
Yeah, everybody likes diamonds, so that's an easy one. Hello, Gunther. Um, Clint, do you want a diamond? I don't really want to give a diamond to Clint, but... Snap, I can't type because you're on my... No, but he does love aquamarine, which I brought some of. He's got like a Christmas sweater on. That's kind of cute. Okay, I gave all these people gifts already. Coming to this stream from a speedrunner? Oh yeah, we're not really speedrunning. I'm playing with Expanded for the first time, so I'm, I'm more just kind of hanging around trying to see everything and meet people. Um, and less trying to speedrun. I'm not being slow, let's be clear, but I'm not trying to go at any sort of speedrunning pace, all right? I'm gonna keep these things on me because I might give them as gifts next time I play, so I remember what I was up to. Okay, and then I'll just put away all my things. I guess I could put those away. Do I wanna make any more? I'm running really low on coal. Ooh. Get myself set up here for next time. A little bit more iron. Um, do the starfruit need watering? No, I put them in the, I can show you. I have them in the greenhouse, so the starfruit have, um, watering cans, or watering cans, I mean, sprinklers on them, so I don't need to water them. Yay! Okay, all my cheese is getting made. Um, we'll probably play Animal Crossing next week, Angelic, okay? Um, I've just been having a lot of fun with Stardew recently, so... <laughs> And I've been traveling a lot, um, so I haven't had as much time to stream as I would have liked, but things are getting back to normal, so. Alright, anyway, I finally have my greenhouse. Oh, do you know what I could do? Let me put some of these around up here. Kind of light it up a little bit. We're gonna do some proper decorating at some point, too, and that'll be nice. Just not yet. Oh! I could have used those in here. But yeah, they're watered. <laughs> um, they have sprinklers on them, so. We don't have that much in there, but there's some things in there. And I think tomorrow, um, tomorrow we're gonna play The Sims. So we're gonna do some Sims building, but I'm gonna be live, um, I'm gonna be live tomorrow morning. I usually in the morning on Wednesdays and we're gonna play Sims and do some building is the plan. So that should be fun. Um, and I think I might send my character to bed then. Yeah? You're late? Oh no, I'm sorry that you missed it. It's okay. I'll be live. Uh, I'll be live tomorrow. <laughs> I'll be live tomorrow. Simply, thank you for the prime sub. Um, thank you so much. All right. Look at this. Go to sleep for the night. No, you don't need to water the trees. Um, and I'll be live at 9 a.m. Eastern time tomorrow. Um, is when I'm always live on Wednesdays, is 9 a.m. Eastern Time. So, that is the plan for tomorrow, and then 4 p.m. is my regular stream time for any other day. I also post in the Discord server, I always post, um, my stream schedule, uh, with, like, the specific things, like how we're gonna play Among Us on Thursday and stuff like that, so, <laughs> um, hopefully that helps. Uh, I'm gonna play Among Us on Thursday, the 100 Baby Challenge on Friday, and we're gonna build again on Saturday is our plan for the next few days, so. I think with that though, I would like to maybe go and find someone who's live. Thank you all so much for hanging out and farming with me. I miss streaming, it's always so weird when I travel and I'm like away for a few days. Um, I was at VidCon, which was great fun, but um, I always miss streaming <laughs> um, when, when we do that. But, okay, how about this? Um, my friend Luxy, is playing the new Story of Seasons game that just, it came out today, right? I've been wanting to watch somebody play it. Um, and Luxie's stream is also sponsored. So let's go support our friends, yeah? <laughs> Keep paying Luxie. <laughs> um, let's go, let's go watch Luxie play the new game though. I'm quite excited about that. Um, but thank you for, for hanging out. Um, if you like Stardew Valley, you are definitely gonna like Story of Seasons. Um, 
it's the new Story of Seasons It's a Wonderful Life game, um, which I'm quite excited about. So let's go over and say hello. It looks absolutely beautiful, by the way. Um, so say hi to Luxie for me, and I shall catch you in the morning. We'll do some simming, yeah? Anyway, this game has like serious Stardew vibes though. So if you like this, I think I think you'll like it. <laughs> um, my cat wants me to go downstairs and feed her though. So I have to go. <laughs> anyway, have a great night, everybody. Thank you for hanging out. Say hi to Lexi and I shall see you tomorrow, okay? Okay, goodbye.